That's right. <laughs> You are tuned in to the number one social media show on the net with your host, Bernardo, WBGF-TV. Center is on once again. Ah, huh? with Bernardo and our good friends right here, Michael Sazon. Billy Wright, say it loud and say it clear. Billy, Billy Wright, Michael, Michael Sazon, Michael Wright. <laughs> Michael now it's actually it's Billy Wright and Michael Sasson. Michael Sasson bringing the flavor to your ears, and it's your boy Billy Wright. Anything that he you know, he's always right, and if he's wrong, he's always right, even when he's wrong. What did I say? Did I say that wrong? I messed up. <laughs> I some something happened with the phone. I think we got a little bit uh, uh, crazy here, so we all got a little bit mixed around. But we're here, Bernardo. We're here, Billy Wright and Michael Sasson. We are here, so we can get this. Uh, this thing on the road. We are open. The crisis center of the Bernardo Freestyle Crisis Center is open. I got a hotline right here on the screens. Anyone wants to call in and uh, give us your your freestyle crisis that happened over the weekend? Look, for example, I got Marco Nieves over here. You know he got shut down. Marco, <laughs> uh, 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 Marco Nieves got shut down. Yo, that's what he get shut down for. He <laughs> what he get shut down for? Yo, this Bro, he like, yo, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in Facebook jail, son. Oh my god. So, so yeah, he'll that's, call, a... that's yo, right here, right here. You can call me through Face, like through Messenger, and you can call me through uh, this hotline right here, this baby right here. So you can uh, just speak, say what's up, say what, what's, what's the crisis in your area? What's the freestyle uh, crisis? Uh, hey, hey Bernardo, I got a, I got a quick short two second crisis. Uh... I got a message from an Asian lady that's around the corner from Frankie's Colors from the laundry man. She oh, said oh, to oh, tell oh, Frankie oh. to go pay the twelve dollars and fifty cents that he owes him for his laundry. That's, that's some low shit right there. <laughs> he owes twelve fifty to 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 the you talking about the laundry man around the house? Frankie, around the corner, the Asian that, lady, the Asian lady said that. Did I just hear right now? Okay, so the the maybe local maybe, maybe, maybe he's got to take a trip. Yeah, the local dry cleaner by Frankie Cutler's house, the lady messaged you and she said that to tell Frankie to go pay her the twelve dollars and fifty cents Frankie owes for the dry cleaner. Twelve dollars and fifty cents for his dry cleaner. That's low, Frankie. We're gonna get we have to get Frankie on, on the line for this. <laughs> we, we, this is this is really, and I think what we should do is, you know, we should probably put like a GoFundMe together or something for Frankie, and, and at least right. pay his four dollars and fifty cent uh, dry cleaning bill because he's he's been on the show many times. He deserved that from us. Frankie has hit rock bottom with this one. Twelve dollar and fifty cent to the Asian lady around the, the the dry cleaner around his house. That's low. That's very low. Frankie. Call me whenever you can. Uh, we got Marco Nieve that he wants to call, like call, like he wants <coughs> to say what's up, like the, some some kind of freestyle beef with Marco Nieve. Freestyle artist Marco Nieve got like uh, Marcos, bro. You know my boy Marcos, bro. Where's he from? Marcos is like from uh, Jersey or Philly. Remember Marcos? I don't remember Marcos. Man. Marcos, bro, we that's probably why. That's probably, that's probably why he's in Facebook jail because nobody knows him. Nick, you uh, sure he's not that guy that says, "Yo, fellas, yo, fellas, yo, fellas, but he got my head." I blow up, yo, fellas. You sure that's not him? I mean, I mean, maybe I'm confusing with the, 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 the music. Don't cross the line, people, because you know, I mean, this weekend have been crazy for us over here. Uh, like, 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 like. Like the Italians are after the show, like like the cops. Also, the cops are after the show, like crazy, bro. I'm like, hey, 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 no bullying, don't bully me. Don't, 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 
Don't you Rocky Ramo me. Yo, Rocky Ramo. Yo, yesterday I saw a video. Yo, where Rocky at? That's some crazy video that I saw yesterday. Yo, that's, yo that video was crazy. Billy White seen it, and he couldn't believe it. Billy was like, oh, my God, this shit is crazy, man. When I'm seeing him I, with my own eyes, I'm like, Bernardo, it can't be true. And the children could not watch it, so that's why Facebook took it off. And then, and then, and then the video got taken off. Yeah. Yeah, so Billy, Billy, Billy White's got a photographic memory. I remember everything that was said and everything. But see, they would have to pay me to not uh, uh, say what I had seen. Yeah. Hey, I'll give you some candy. You say it, Billy. Say it, we, need, we need. They need to start. They, they need to start paying us for this stuff because you know we we we, we hold a lot of secrets with this with this uh, freestyle crisis. I mean, we, we're trying to hold off on it, but if they if they pay me like a cheesesteak or something, I, I might just tell, tell everything. Fuck it. Okay, we need. Oh, I, I'm Yeah, we need uh, uh, Marcos Nieves. We need Marcos Nieves. Your presence is uh, wanted over here in the freestyle crisis center. You can call us uh, through messenger. Or through the the crisis line that we have uh, over here, We've got a crisis line now. So you know, for anyone who's got a freestyle crisis and they want to talk about it, here's the crisis, the hotline for the crisis center. You can call us up, or you can call us um, uh, Facebook Messenger. And um, so yeah, that's what we got. We got yesterday a uh, freestyle Ricky. We need freestyle Ricky on the line. Like, what's up with this? <laughs> what happened here, Freestyle Ricky? What happened here? We want to get to the of this. Mm, mm. Freestyle Ricky knows everything. Yep, we need to get to the bottom of this Free one. Yo, Bernardo, what's up? Freestyle Ricky, Freestyle Ricky, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I apologize, guys, to keep on, you know, buttoning it, but Freestyle Ricky, he needs to call because he knows all the dark secrets that, that, that people want to know. Let me call Freestyle Ricky first. That's what I'm going to do. Hold on one second. Give me a second. Let's call Freestyle Ricky first. Give me one second. Let me call. Stay right there. We're going to get to the bottom of this, people. Oh, we're going to get to the bottom of this. We're going to get to the bottom of this whole where he at. How do I get Ricky on the line? Okay. Give me a second. Give me a second, people. There we go. That's my boy Ricky right here. Oh, Marcos. Marcos is calling our first. Let me, let me. Marcos Nieves. Mr. Good evening to the Freestyle Crisis Center. Ah, he hung up. Marcos. Okay, let's talk Freestyle Ricky first. What's up with my boy Ricky? <laughs> get to the bottom of this let's call marcos hold on one second marco was calling me hold it hold it Señor marcos, no, Señor marcos Nieves, how are you good evening hey bernardo how you doing how are you my bro how you doing tonight uh, uh i'm doing good you know i'm just trying to enjoy your show you know what, what happened enjoying the night why you what happened to your facebook bro why we all you know? man i don't know what the hell happened on facebook like this this facebook is getting corny as hell i'm over here sharing my music and next thing you know uh, i get a restriction notice all oh, you've been restricted i'm like what for sharing your own stuff so what does that mean you can't share your own stuff yeah, that's what it seems like. I can't share my music. I guess that's what it looks like to me. They got me on Facebook jail till like a, like a day or so. I guess I don't know. This is the first time I'm in Facebook jail. Like I never even heard of Facebook jail. Like what the fuck is that? So, so you're telling me you're going to be in jail and then you're on parole for how long? <laughs> I think for a couple of days. Nah, yeah. So you're only on parole for a couple of days? On parole? On parole? Yeah. 
But what do you think, like, what do you think created this, this whole thing? Like, <laughs> like, what do you think created this that, you know, so, so something that you can tell us that way none of us could get, you know, get, you know, none of us could go through this thing, this whole Facebook jail stuff. Yo, 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 Bernardo, you next. Yo, yo, hey, you yo, yo, Bernardo, you about to be in Facebook next. jail next. Keep on with this right, um, crisis center. You next. <laughs> Think I'm next? Uh, what? Yeah, you want to be next? Who's in the background? Who's in the background? Uh, 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 Michael, we got uh, Michael Sassone and um, Billy Wright. Billy Wright, you want to say something to the lady in the background? Yeah, who, who is she? Who's the lady in the background, uh, uh, Marcos? Oh, that's my cousin. Oh, it doesn't matter who she is. Put her on the phone for a second. <laughs> let us talk. To, let me. Let me. Let's talk to her. <laughs> Are you sure you want to talk to her? Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. We want to talk to her. Uh, I don't, don't think you really want to talk to her. We do. We do. We do. We do. I want to talk to her. <laughs> no, no, she don't want to talk. Want to talk? Oh man. Yeah, she don't want to oh, talk. Man. But no, but she heard my yeah. But seriously now. speaking, She's though, like, I don't really care about the Facebook jail shit. I was just the first time that that happened to me. That's why I said what I said. But I don't really give a damn about that shit because that's the way it is. That's how I, that's how I think about it. Like shit, fuck it. Yeah, you're gonna be good, my bro. You're yeah, gonna I wanna... be good. And my, my uh, Marcos, uh, your music. Could could you give us like uh, I want to be able for uh, there's a lot of people here for people to hear your music because you've been a freestyle artist for a long, long time and you make amazing music. So we go. Well, thank on, you. Yeah. We go on YouTube uh -huh. and we click what we say, Marco Nieves, and what's your like bet like your most famous song. Most uh, famous freestyle collaboration till now. Well, the only thing that you have to do is go on YouTube, click on um, uh, Marcos Nieves or, or Latin freestyle artist Marcos Nieves, and you'll see an, uh, an array of different songs there. Um, you can listen to uh, Where Did Your Heart Go, Was came out in 2010. Um, a lot of my songs came after that. So, you know, uh, my, my recent song is out called Broken. That song is out now being played. Um, so I love it, you'll be able to hear that in the stations. Yeah. Marcus, What's up? I love it that you call uh, that you know that we get it, you know, through a crisis and then and and you know, we uh definitely uh advertise you know because you're one of those amazing freestyle artists and we advertise your music over here. I wish uh, Marcus, I appreciate more you. freestyle artists will do the same. Thank you, Marcos. Thank you so much, okay? Yeah, you take care, have a good night. All right. All right, guys. So there's a call here from somebody, uh, from the someone who called the uh, crisis center. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, okay. Let's see. Bernardo, Bernardo, real quick, can we? Somebody called the crisis center. Hold on. Hello. Hello. Hello, the crisis. Uh, good evening. Yes. Sir. Hello. You were calling the crisis center, the freestyle crisis center. Yeah. How you doing? This is Lenny. Lenny Speedo. Lenny Speedo? Who? Yeah, that's Lenny Speedo. Big time promoter. Oh, Lenny. Guys, it's Lenny oh. Speedo. Lenny, hey! Lenny, hey, Lenny! Yes, all right. That's, that's what I thought. I know my name is Bell. Listen, I know I called in the other night about the big show going down at Stop and Shop. You guys familiar with it? Yeah, we saw something like that. We did okay. something about that. Can you, can right. you tell us about that more? Well, yeah, I, I, I got to update everybody a little bit more, right? Okay. Now, during the show, the produce aisle will remain open. We also are going to have pomegranates going down for, pomegranates three for a dollar. But during the show, please don't bring your shopping carts in the aisle. It's a safety issue in case you defy you. All right? We understand everybody has shopping to do, but we need them to be patient. After the show, AKT will be taking pictures with the fans at the deli counter. All right? They're also going to be slicing meat for your convenience. Meat and greet packages are starting at $19.99 and includes a free deli combo. Now, the deli combo is half pound American, half pound of deli ham. The importance is going to be extra. Now, the first 20 people to the door, they get a free bag of potatoes. But be warned, if someone starts assaulting me, just stay calm. This shit happens to me all the time because of my big mouth. I'll just sue later. It's what tough guys do. Wow. Now, 
I would like everyone to meet us at the after party at the Curry Up Food Truck, located in the back parking lot of the abandoned mental hospital in Hawaiian Dance, Long Island. The boys are going to be cooking up all your curry favorites while singing the three songs they actually wrote. Now, autographs will also be available, but you got to be patient because only one of them can read. After the party has really? concluded, you're going to be giving everybody a ride home. Rates start at 35 cents a mile for the first 30 and 75 cents thereafter. Okay? I got some other events coming up. I got another artist I'm breaking out. Wow, who is that? Cocky Vamos. Can we have some VIP tickets for us? Have you heard of Cocky Vamos? No, sir. No? He's huge. No. This has been a big week for him. He just came out. So I want everybody to come out themselves what's and his, celebrate with us name, at the show he's doing at the Laundry Kingdom in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. Did you say Pocky? Yeah, Cocky Vamos. Yo, I know who that is. I know who that is. Okay. All right. I now, also, no. I'd like to announce the comeback of Vanilli. I know Vanilli passed away, <laughs> but Lenny Speedo's the number one promoter in the game. That's right. I got this. You got this. Also, hey, hey, stay tuned for me? 80s J-Lo. She has no actual musical talent, but she's going to be saying the word I poppy for about three hours. Okay. And as always, this will be done in the key of G. In the so, uh, guys, you have yes, a question for Lenny right here? Yeah, Lenny, I'm just, I'm just wanting to know, can, can we bring the Bernardo show to the event? <sighs> you know, we can talk about it, but we're going to need some help putting the cards away after the show. So if you're willing to borrow your time, you know, we can talk later. Off air. Thank you. Thank Do you. Do you know anything else that's going on? Well... I got, a, I got a GoFundMe page going on because you've, uh, you know, I got, I got some issues going on where I live. So if you want to head over to LennySpeedo.com, you know, you can put a few dollars down on that. Okay. Okay. Thank you, mister. Thank I'll you for that. giving us a call. And uh, don't be a stranger to the program, okay? This is the Free Stock Crisis yeah. Center. And, uh, thank you. Thank you, sir. Yo, that is one, yeah. Yo, that is a very <laughs> unique Event. <laughs> that is a very, very yeah, I can't, I can't cocky ring. <laughs> That's a very, very unique. So, so where, yeah, where, yeah, where's, 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 uh, uh, Billy Wright? Billy Wright, you there? Is Billy Wright there? I don't know where. He, okay. Uh, he might have went to the bathroom he again. The but bathroom. listen. Okay. All, all I gotta say is that we are not bullying nobody, and no we bullying. don't have control of what everybody no says. Bullying. No bullying. <laughs> well, so we want to get Mr. Uh, uh, we want to get Mr. We're looking for a Mr. Rocky Ramos, so we can uh, hear what he need. You know, he wants to he wants to say about uh, what Freestyle Ricky uh, said in that video the other day, like yesterday, I think it was. And uh, we want to get Freestyle <clears throat> Ricky also on the phone, so. Let me try to get Freestyle Ricky on the phone, okay? Ricky, I'm trying to call you, my bro. And this is the Christ Ricky. line. This is the Ricky, Ricky's not picking up the phone. Hello? Ricky, uh, uh, good evening, sir. Uh, how are you tonight? My name is Bernardo Garcia. You're my and uh, we're live at the Crisis Center. You're so stupid. I probably do. I think I work. How are you tonight, sir? What? What's up? Sir, we saw. Yesterday, we saw a video. Oh, this is A video that you posted saying. Some things about a, a freestyle artist named Rocky Ramos. Right. And the video guy got shut down. Got, you know, yeah. Here. What happened here, my bro? Can you explain it to us? How, how, All right. how, how did it happen? How did you get, like, what did you say to yourself? I'm going to go live. I'm going to, I have to go live and film this because the whole entire world is going to hear me now. Uh,
Okay. Um, the other day, um, some guy, I don't know who his name is, he went by the name of Larry, he inboxed me a conversation that he had with Rocky, Ernesto Lorenzo. Well, yeah, we'll give the whole government. And he sent it to me, and Rocky was like, oh, that, that faggot, freestyle Ricky, he could suck dick and balls, pussy-ass bitch, some shit like that. Now, mind you, we was cool, so I don't know where the hell this came from. So um, I reached out to him, all, like all three of his profiles on Facebook. Um, two, he did not respond. The other one, he, he read the message and then blocked me. So I tried to reach out to him, man to man, you know, because I didn't want to take it there. But when you blocked me, I took it there. And that's, that's what was the premise of the video. Did this, this, this thing happen to her? Back in the days? Um, no, we didn't do anything. But he shared with me when he came to um, our birthday bash in New York at the Lemon Tree in 2009. Because we used to, t we were talking on the phone, before, you know, prior to meeting him, I, you know, from MySpace to Facebook. So we always talked. We never met until 2009 when he came over and performed at our birthday bash. And he had shared with me that he was curious, he was attracted to me, and he wanted his first time to be with me. And I was like, I was like shocked. I was like, what? Like, I didn't even know what to say, but like, that was it. And nothing ever happened. No kissing, no nothing like that. And we were cool. You know, I kept a secret between me and him. Never said nothing because, you know, we were cool. We were friends. So I would take that secret. But when you go and you're talking to someone on in the inbox and you're calling me a faggot, go suck dick and balls, you pussy ass bitch. Well, what about what you wanted to do? Y'all are a closet faggot. How about that? So I had to let everybody know, you know, people want to say and do whatever the hell they want. But then, you know, there's a lot of people in the background that have skeletons. Ricky. And I just so happened to to have that skeleton and I yeah. took it out the closet. Can Billy, can Billy, can Billy read from, from what uh, Rocky Ramos actually uh, wrote to uh, Freestyle Ricky? Can I have it on, on the screen shine? Can I just read this little piece and then you can go back to your story? Sure. This is what it reads. From Rocky Ramos. Uh, I'll beat your fat ass too. Ha ha. You don't need bitch fucking singing Oh, now I know who you are, Ricky, faggot, freestyle, ha, ha, ha. Peace, go keep sucking cock and drinking cum on my pussy. That's some hard words for an artist to come at you like that. Well, right. especially a friend, especially a friend. Right. So, so I, I was kind of like shocked that he had did that, and then I said to myself, you know what? I don't need to keep this secret between me and him anymore because he 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 broke a he broke the friendship when he said that. Right. You know, I don't care. I don't want to hear. Oh, I was pissed off, or or or, or whatever the case may be. Friends don't do that. No. And like I said, the person he was talking to, I don't know that person from a hole in the wall. They must have seen me from being inside your group. And sent it to me and said, check this out, dude. And uh, I read it. And then I was like, I was like, are you fucking kidding me? Like, Rocky was hitting me up when, when, when he was calling, you know, F Frankie out that night. When he was saying, Frankie, you bitch-ass motherfucker, where are you at? Like, he, he was inboxing me. So I don't understand what happened. Right. Uh, well, all right. So let's try to get Rocky on the, Rocky Ramos on the, on the phone. Then again, you know, this is, uh, uh, yeah, let's <laughs> well, I'm sure he's going to no, take no. a little vacation, but you could try. Yeah, let's try. Let's try. Thank you, Ricky. No. Thank you. I'll call you back. Thank you. Yo, uh, uh, guys, can you guys hear me out there? Can Are you guys mon Can you monitor me? Hello? One, yeah, two. I hear you. Not unclear. One, two, one, two. One, 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 two. One, 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 two. Yeah. Can you, hear, can you guys hear me out there? Okay, there's another call. Okay. One two one two. Okay, Ricky's calling. Uh, Ricky. Oh, damn you! You hung up in me. I wasn't finished talking. Yeah, but no, because I'm having some kind of mic difficulties here. So before. All right. So listen. Uh -huh. I I want you to call Rocky if you Rocky answers. I want to call in. I don't want Rocky on the other side. I want Rocky no, to tell me through the phone. I don't have another another device here. I only have one device. So. 
Let me see what I can do. Let me get, uh, let me check my audio. I'll call you right back, okay? Well, they have they have three way two, motherfucker. Okay, hold on one second. Uh, All right, guys, can you can you guys tell me if everything is okay? Do you guys hear me? Uh, 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 Michael, Michael Sassone, uh, and uh, Billy Wright, can you monitor if my sound is coming out all right? Because I'm having some people telling me that my voice is not coming out. I hear you loud and clear. Don't we you, can hear you loud and clear, yeah. but Billy got you. Get some more phones. Okay. So, yeah, we hear you. Okay, we hear you. Remember, people, uh, no, no bullying, and this is just R Ricky... Freestyle Ricky, that's what he says. Okay, this is the idea right here. The idea is we need to man up. Everybody here needs to man up. So Ricky, you know, yesterday he said, I'm going to do this video. Anyone can post a video, say whatever they want about anyone. But that's just like a gossip, people. It's gossip. It's nothing. It's garbage. You can't be taking people serious like that. It's the gossip. It's some stuff. That's what he says. That's what he says. Anybody can, I can tell you, where, where's, where's uh, Victoria? Victoria, you owe me $100. Victoria, uh, uh, move, uh, $100. Johnny Mans, Johnny Mans owes me, he owes me $1,500. Like, people, I can go on over here and say whatever I want to say about anyone. You need to, people, we all need to start saying like, yo, this is just some Facebook stuff. We, the technology is here and people say whatever the hell they want to say. Don't bring me on this shit. Remember, you don't owe remember, me, you don't owe me have... money, but but when I you owe me a kiss, you owe me a nice kiss. So so say say remember, it. We don't... Say it. Billy, Billy, just, Billy just wants to say that that he actually saw the video that was posted by Freestyle Ricky, and one thing that Freestyle Ricky forgot to to mention was that what he said on his video was a nice little part. He said that. That Rocky Ramos wanted him to be his first, What's first in, in this uh, let me, uh, let me sexual get, yeah. uh, LGB relation. What? Let me get Rocky in the As we talk with when he comes back up, that he said that Rocky Ramos has. Ne it sounds like he's never experienced another man, but in this situation, he was. He wanted freestyle Ricky to be. His first, and, and that's yeah. what I'm, I'm just going off of what I've seen from the video. No Freestyle, way. Ricky. Freestyle Ricky posted. I mean, you can call him back when you call him and ask let, him. Let me see. I was in shock. I mean, it could be possible. Some people could come out the closet or they're trying to hide no, no, in the closet. They don't want no, to come out the closet. Not Rocky Ramos. Rocky Ramos is a G. Rocky Ramos is a G. Let me get Rocky on the line. Hold on one second. Hold on one second. This is just some stuff that people say. You know, anyone can say anything, especially when you're beefing with people. You know, you know how it is. You 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 beef with somebody, you're upset, and then you say whatever you want to say, and then who knows? Maybe later on, and other you, you know, know. An, another time, people say, "Nah, that was all garbage or whatever." So don't you, believe everything you hear, because you know, I don't. I don't. You know what it is? That's that. That's probably that Cali love. Cali love. Give it up. Give it up. Give it up. Cali oh yeah. That's how we party. Let me call, let oh, yeah. try to get Rocky. That's on. how we party. Oh, yeah. Let me try to get Rocky on the line. <laughs> Hey, we're not a real party. Let me get, let me get, let me see if I can get Rocky Ramos on the line. I'm not answering. Rocky, can somebody call Rocky? Let him know that we're trying to call him so we can clear this one up. I want to clear it up. There's a freestyle crisis center. The crisis center is not to make it worse. It's to clear shit up immediately. Like, you know, so freestyle Rick is upset, and that's what he did. Who knows? Maybe he dreamt about it. Rock is a, a nice-looking dude. You know, maybe he dreamt about it, and you, who knows, bro? Hey, 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 why are you looking at dudes like that? No, because I'm trying to, you know, I'm trying to, I'm trying to tell everyone over here that just because somebody makes a video, somebody says something about somebody, that shit don't mean that shit is true. Especially now, bro. That's just like a gossip, bro. Gossip. You're not supposed to. I don't, I don't know. I've seen the video. Huh. Really seen the video several times, and it looked like Freestyle Ricky was so sincere about the whole situation. And you know a lot of times nowadays, 
what you're getting out here, you're getting these big muscle bound, fucked up dudes that after a while they keep on lifting these weights and lifting these weights and they start looking at other dudes and saying, oh my God, you're looking uh, mighty nice. Well, you got nice pecs and before you know it, they want to try and test some new territories. But that you know, territory is not territories we want to test. Mm -mm, no, you know no, no, no. You know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking <laughs> you know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking there's like a freestyle conspiracy theory against a lot of people out there. Because, you know, it's crazy how it is that the ones that I like is the one that are constantly being bombarded with nonsense. The one that I like, I mean, the ones that if I had bread, I would invest in them because I think they're great for this times, for the year 2019, 220 coming up. Like, for example, I would never invest no money in no freestyle artist. I, but I would invest money in Rocky Ramos because he his personality is, 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 is amazing, bro. You know, because we're living in this Cardi B kind of entertainment uh, 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 times now. Rocky Ramo Amaretto. I will, I will invest a lot of bread in Amaretto. I love Amaretto. I would invest in Freestyle Ricky. I will invest in, in Frankie Cutlass because Frankie Cutlass knows how to entertain people. He's got everyone entertain people. Frankie Cutlass don't care. He don't care. Where Frankie at? Frankie, you owe the lady... The lady, yo, what, can we tell Frankie what happened with the Vietnamese lady, the Asian lady? Michael, you're the one that received the message. What did the uh, Asian lady said? Oh, yeah, so that, that, the Asian lady said that Frankie Cutlass needs to come pay his $12.50 for his dry cleaning that he dropped off to her not too long ago. Yeah. I don't know how long it's been, but yeah. he only thought I was a city said. That's that's low. Frankly, yeah, that's low. That's low. Tiene que hacer mucho tiempo, porque si no da mucho tiempo, esa mujer no viene por ahí a preguntar a otra persona que pagó ese ticket. I'm going to get Angelo. I'm going to get Angelo on the line because Angelo lives in the same neighborhood. I want to be able to get Angelo on the line and see if, uh, you know, what's up with this. <laughs> We should get Angelo to pay because you know he's just, he just like a right hand man. He's yeah. like a bodyguard yeah, to that man. Yeah, we, we need to. We, yeah. Hold he on. one time wore some booty shorts and nobody said, Frankie Cutters, I love you. Hey, <laughs> good evening, Angelo. 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 My name is Bernardo Garcia. Uh, I'm calling you from the Freestyle Crisis Center. Uh, this oh, wow. Well, this is my first time on the show. What up? Yeah. Well, this is not really a freestyle crisis. It's more like a dry cleaning crisis. Okay. So oh, what? The, the, we're trying to get those cum stains off the shirt? and she didn't come off? Okay. So the, it was, right? So the Asian lady from the dry cleaning in your area says she called, she messaged. What's the area? What's the area? The one that you and, and Frankie Cutler, where Frankie lives at. She's saying that Frankie mm. Cutler uh, owes $12.50. For his dry clothes. No, no, nah, I got it all twisted. See, I had to put my clothes in there you, under you his me, name because I didn't want to get caught out that, there. Just, 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 trying to you remove those cum stains off the you shirt. Stay, stay you know what I'm saying? Stay I bust off too much, and I was like, damn, I'm going to take these off. So I brought them to the Asian lady, and she's like, oh, oh, you work for Frankie Cutlass? I said, yes. So she thought I said Frankie Cutlass. Feel me? That's what happened. So That's who, what happened. So who exactly? Why does Billy Billy bullshit sound like he got no neck? Billy, Billy, sir. Sounds like he got no neck. Billy, right? Yeah, I can't hear it. Let me go. Sounds like he got no neck. And you know, he sounds like Beretta from back in the days. One, one other time, Billy, right? One other time. Mr. Kojak, what up? Billy's got a neck. It's not real big, but I got a nice little, little neck. It's small, and small, but not real big. Okay. So you wanted to... I didn't even sound right. Pause. Yeah. Jesus. Mike, Michael, don't, we... get, don't get Bernardo excited, man. You know what happens when you mention neck or anything that sounds close to anything like that? He starts bugging the fuck out. Uh, Angela, what do you think of this? Uh, uh, you think uh, this... Uh, uh... Ricky, uh, uh, Rocky, uh, uh, that should sound 100% real to me. That shit don't sound real to me. I know Rocky, Rocky. it sounds Rocky. real to me. Nah. Why the fuck would he put that on video? So, why is it you can't reach him? 
because he's having he, 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 he's he, he, he was around he would defend he's himself i'm pretty sure he got the word already from this morning i'm just saying you know why would he reason why would he have reason to lie why would ricky have reason to lie why oh okay he's got a family, there gotta be some truth behind that you're trying to call him he's not picking up you know what i'm saying last week when he was arguing with with uh frankie i thought it was a girl at first that high-pitched voice so you know might be some truth behind there i don't think so sir I know Rocky. Rocky is a real G. You know him, know him? I know him, bro. He's a G, bro. Yeah, I bet you G. do know him. I bet you do. <laughs> yeah, Bernardo. Yo, Rocky. Go, no boy. Man. No, no. Rocky don't even play no game, bro. Rocky is a veteran of, right. of many, many, shoe, many amazing, beautiful. I, I know a bunch that of That shit girls. don't mean nothing. He was curious. You heard the man. He wanted his first time to be with him. Nah. So who knows nah, after conspiracy. what happened after that? I'm just saying. It's a conspiracy. I kind of believe Ricky. Anybody out there believe Ricky, man? I don't believe Ricky. Let's see some hearts in the comment. Put some hearts in the comment if you believe him. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see those hearts in the comment. Show yeah. some love. Yeah. Well, sir. Uh, uh, we, yeah. We, yeah. 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 What was that? I couldn't hardly hear you. Lift your, your head up or something. Expose your neck so your Adam Apple, Apple could be clear. Yeah. You know, then he said that it's okay if he wants to be a homo sub. He can do that. We, we, we don't discriminate. Oh, word. Yeah, exactly. Ain't no problem with that. You know, homo thug. People should have known sooner. Put his ass in jail like Robert Downey Jr. Word. So, you know, uh, yeah, we, we uh, tell your, your uh, if you see Frankie, bro, tell, tell him we would love to speak to him around here. Nah, you saw what Frankie did, though, right? You saw the love he gave back to the hood, all the book bags. Yeah, you saw I the see, kids I on my team come to get them. They couldn't even carry those bags. Yeah. There were so many stuff yeah. up in there. Frankie gives back to the hood, man. Yeah. I'm pretty sure you saw the video. Angela, and that's just the beginning. We have Christmas what about, coming. What about the dry you know what I'm saying? Why hasn't he given back to the dry clean? The lady with the dry clean, that was my shit, bro. Damn. Just told you that. So that you can't even speak That's English. Windy. She can't dial numbers. I went in there for close. She said number nine, number nine. Number nine. Number I was like nine. Nine. number nine. No, number no, nine. No, I ate already. Number nine. Number nine. All right, sir. Thank you for clearing I'm, this up. Thank, thank you, Angela. We'll call you right back. Down. We'll call you right back. All right, brother. All right, my brother. All right. So here it is. Here it is, people. This is the number right here. You can call me through uh, f uh, Facebook Messenger, and. Um, or you can call us through the uh, hotline. We got a hotline. And, uh, yeah, share that video. We got a crisis hotline. And uh, who's talking? Who's talking? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, uh, Michael. Yo, we need to talk yeah. to you, bro. Like, okay, hold on one second. Oh, Frankie Cutlass is calling, bro. The Cutlass is calling. Hold on. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Good, e Good evening, Mr. C uh, Frankie Cutlass. Uh, welcome to the Freestyle Crisis Center. Thank you. What's up, guys? Mister, What's going on? Yeah. I'm sorry to bother you for what I'm about to tell you, but um, I got to tell you, you know, a message that came through to us. There's a, a lady, a nation lady around your area that she owns a dry cleaner. And since she's seen the, like a lot of posting over here, somebody said, call these people. They can help you. She says that you owe for three months $12.50. In, in, All right, Bernardo. Bernardo, Bernardo, stop, stop. You sound stupid right now. You're, you're acting really stupid. Your co-hosts are acting really stupid. Come on, let's go. That's next, next story. Let's talk about this James Anthony situation. That's the real deal. You guys are a bunch of idiots up there. Come on, man. I, you know, I respect the show, but when you start talking nonsense like that, it's just, it's just stupid, bro. It becomes stupid. So let's, let's go to the next story, right? Because the next story that I want to talk about is this guy named James Anthony, who's out there claiming that I old money or whatever. Let me tell you the story behind that, okay? So basically, uh, you know, back in the days, we had uh, DJs like the Land Rascals. We had DJs like Freddie Bestone, Shep Pettibone. They used to do uh, what was called back in the day, hot mixes for Hot 103, all right? They used to take their favorite song, you know, whether the Latin, uh, Noel, the cover girl, Sapphire, and they used to take it and they used to splice it up, do overdubs, and they used to call it a hot mix. I was working on a few mixtapes a couple of months ago, so I reached out to uh, Albert Cabrera from the Land Rascals and asked him, look, I want you to do the same thing because I want to put these songs on my mixtape because I didn't want to play the same version that, you know, all the DJs are playing. So I wanted to do different versions like, you know, like the hot mix. 
he told me he couldn't do it because he was he was he was uh, tied up doing some projects. So I reached out to James Anthony. I asked him, James, James, listen, I want like four songs. Can you do four songs like remixes? Because James Anthony is I'm not gonna t I'm not gonna lie. He's a very talented uh, editor, very talented remixer. So I asked James Anthony, listen, I would love to do what the Land Rascals used to do back then and um, kind of put it on my mixtape. You know what I'm saying? And he said, no problem. What do you want? So I told him the songs I want. I said, how much you you want to get paid? He said, I, give me two uh, two hundred and fifty dollars for each. You know, remix. So I gave them the two hundred and fifty. No problem. Everything was good. The reason why I told James Anthony not to tell anybody that you know, not to tell anybody that he did it was because I didn't want anyone, any DJ, reaching out to him to try to get copies of it because I wanted to become the only DJ playing these exclusive remix. There's nothing wrong with that. You understand me? So moving forward, I asked him about a couple of weeks ago for him to do a house remix for me. You know what I'm saying? No problem. He did it. He sent it to me. I said it was it was cool. The reason why I haven't paid James Anthony is because not because I'm broke or not because I don't want to pay him was because I didn't start the I didn't start the last the, the mixtape that I was supposed to start. That's why I haven't paid them. And most importantly, if you can ask anybody, ask Cynthia, even people that's been around me, I'm not gonna lie, I'm very sloppy of uh, not even disciplined when it comes to paying bills or paying people on time. It's not that I'm slacking or I'm just being, you know, I'm procrastinating. It's because you know I just I, I forget. But I stay, you know, I stood in touch with James Anthony. We was going back and forth. It was the last. Uh, last week, two days, he reached me that I didn't text him back because I'm like, okay, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna pay this guy. So that's what happened there. It had nothing to do that I was ducking home. It had nothing to do that I said that I did those remixes. You know, he wanted to get a 15 minutes of fame. He did it. Good. I hope he came behind that. I hope his asshole came. I hope he came. Whatever. He's pleased. I'm tired of people just taking my name, trying to make you know a, a name out of themselves. Through my name, it's just it's getting boring around people. Stop the bullshit already. I'm not gonna answer this stuff no more with you guys. I'm already sick of this stuff. And that's it, man. I'm done with this. So I just wanted to clear this whole situation with James Anthony. That's what happened. It had nothing to do with that. I didn't want to pay home. He took it personal. And even even with Cynthia, you guys, Cynthia, I'm working on Cynthia's project, and she has to constantly call me or text me all the time saying, Frankie, I need this. Frankie, I need this. It's just I have a lot Frankie, on my hands. Frankie, so that's what's I, going Frankie, on Frankie, can I ask you a question, sir? Can I call Cynthia? Do you think Cynthia will pick up the phone for us? No, she won't. No, she won't. Then uh, then we can't call No, her? she won't. She, she's in the chat room. She's in the chat room. So she won't, I talk, saw her on the... she won't talk up to us. Cynthia, because Cynthia doesn't want to get involved. I mean, I, I'm 99.9% percent .9 that she doesn't want to, you know, Look, get involved with this I'm type of stuff. Call her. I'm gonna call her right now and see if she wants to call. If she doesn't if she doesn't pick up the phone, that means she don't want to talk to us. All right, whatever. It's up to you whatever you want to I know she's hey, not gonna talk she doesn't want to get involved. Quick. I got a question, a question from the guys. Hey Frankie, how you doing, sir? Listen, I got a quick question. Um we're trying not to do any bullying, right? But I have a quick question for you. What's this beef that was going back and forth on the text messages with you and one of the the fans on the chat? Uh, Victor, uh, Casper, Victor Casper Santiago. Yeah, he, that's a, that he's a corny ass. He's corny and he keeps throwing, you know, th throwing shots. You know, this is, this is what happens. You know, these people, they follow this gossip, they follow false information and they want to keep throwing shots. So, you know, I went back and forth cause I told them already, what, what do you have against me? Like, have I done anything? To, I have never done anything to this dude. You know what I'm saying? And, and it's like, why you keep throwing shots? Because you listen to people because you're listening to force and gossiping and all that, and so you want to run with that information? Bro, become a leader. Stop being an idiot, bro. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I, that's why I was going back and forth because I was just like, yo, what's wrong with you, bro? I have never done anything. This, this is the problem with a lot of people. I have never done anything personal to people, but they want to just continue, you know, throwing shots at me and continue just, you know, becoming a, 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 a I don't want to say the word, but, you know, it's like, come on, stop it already, man. Stop. Frankie, it, it's getting ridiculous, getting Frankie, stupid already. It's all good, my friend. It means that you're doing great, okay? I believe in you, my bro. bro. I believe in you, my bro. You're doing good. You're doing just fine. You are one of those people that are doing something for a new era of freestyle. Because I've been in this game now for like 12 years back again, and I ain't never seen so much movement, you know. Now, now I see movement. You in here, I see some movement. So I think you're doing just fine, sir. Yeah, I'm cool, but I'm just gonna let you know that this is like, you know, me and you, we spoke already, and hopefully in the future we, we you know, we get down and do some things, but yeah. I'm not gonna call no more. I'm not gonna answer no more questions after this. I'm done with this shit. 
I'm done with the gossip, whatever. Everybody wants to run with stupid shit. Go ahead, do it. It's like, you know, any little thing happened with me or something happened, somebody comes up and make a video. Everybody wants to run with that bullshit. There's always two sides of the story and the truth. You understand what that I'm saying? You're popular, you can't, you can't. sir. You're popular. You're good. You're popping. You're good, bro. I'm good. You're I'm super good. good. God bless, Frankie. Have a good night, man. my friend. All right, man. Bye-bye. Take care. All right, guys. Damn, son. Damn, Frankie. Hey, I just seen a post from Rocky. It says he's busy in the lab working on the next hit. Got off the phone with someone famous who wants to collab with business first, guys. Business first. So Rocky don't want to come through. Let's call. Uh, shoot, let me call Cynthia. Maybe she wants to pick up. If she don't pick up, it's okay. <laughs> but I want to share. You know, let me see. If she don't want to call, it's okay. Cynthia. Let me see if she wants to. I don't think she's going to. It's ringing. Queen Cynthia. Yeah, well, Queen Cynthia is not answering. Okay, so, um, Billy, let me call Rocky. Let me see. Let me see. Rocky, come on, bro. Come on, dude. Rocky, dude. You're like the hottest story of the night, man. Pick up the phone, man. Oh, that, what's the name of the guy? What's the name? What's the name of the guy? The uh, for the, the what's the name of the, what's the name of the guy that we have to call that uh, Frankie Cutlass is talking about? Um, hold on. Could somebody tell me the name of the guy that we need to call? No, 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 no. Yeah, Zeke. No, no, Zeke, no. The guy that Frankie, that guy that... <laughs> no, 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 Zeke, no, 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 Zeke, no. Zeke is too much. No. Uh, the guy... What do you, what do you mean? No, no, no. About James Anthony? James Anthony. James? James, James Anthony. Anthony. Uh, James Anthony. Okay, yeah, Kelowna. Yeah, let's... Something like that, James, whatever it is. James Anthony. James Anthony. I don't have him. I don't have him as my friend. I don't think I could call him Anthony. James Anthony. I don't got this dude as my friend, bro. Well, you know, you know what I wanted to ask, Bernardo. Frankie Keller, but James, I have to step James, out to the, James to the Anthony, bathroom. James Anthony, if if you can uh, see me, if you're watching us, you can call me at this number. This is our crisis hotline. Nine five four. Two one two nine zero zero one. Uh, uh, Mister Mister um, Billy Wright, you want to say something? Yeah, Billy Wright. Uh, you know, I had to step out to go to the bathroom real quick, but I had realized I had a question from Mister Cutlass. But he, you know, he's I see he's not on when I come back. But it, it didn't have to do with this guy. It really had to do with Zeke. I seen something on uh, Facebook chat, and it was something to the effect that uh. It looked like Zeke was upset because uh, Frankie Cutlass was going to put out that he was uh, he had uh, his criminal criminal uh, history, and that, that was, I wanted to find out what was what was going on with him and Zeke. That was something that they were uh, going at it over. Uh, supposedly, uh, Zeke's trying to say that he was going to put, put out his criminal history. Yeah, yeah, that's not cool. That's very dirty. Yeah, that's very dirty. The idea is that you know let's let's try to make freestyle a better place. That's why, you know, the idea on the for example the crisis center is that I know I know it's tough. You know I, I know the content is tough, but I think at least we have a place where we are somehow talking to each other, and uh, you know and that's a start. That's a start. We're talking. We're in that talking terms at this particular moment. We're you know. So, yeah, and if we're talking for sure, uh, please, I hate it when people post, like, people's addresses. You shouldn't do that. That's wrong. Well, we can't bully, guys. Can't That's bully, right? bullying. No bullying. Now, can I, can I tell you exactly what I'm, I'm going to read, what, what uh, Frankie Cutlass wrote on here to uh, speak? It was, I told you to keep my name out of your mouth. I'm going to expose you. Let's see if it's a crook here. Right. So there's still, still some uh, issues with Zeke. 
Let's call Z. Nah. No, Come on. No, no, Come on. I don't want to call Z. I don't want to call Z. Everybody wants to hear from Z right now because he's supposed to be on Friday. Let's call him. Let's call him. You want to call him? Let's call him. I don't think he's going to Let's pick call up. him. No, I don't have Seek it, but bro, Seek, uh, uh, yeah. Delete. Seek is delete. We delete. Block and delete and over blocked and over deleted. Oh, well, it was going to be a good, it was going to be a good story. There's a lot of people there that don't understand that we're doing a show with a strong content, but these people do believe that, you know, they, 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 this is why I love the Freestyle Crisis Center. If, 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 if at least if we can get the, the, you know, the, the message across that, yo, chill, bro. You know, it's okay. Like, for example, Frankie just called right now. He's like, stop it with that shit. You know, but hey, 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 Bernardo, calm down, Mister. Somebody, somebody wrote, somebody wrote and said that uh, Zeke must hear you that you're really scared of him. Can we call that person? What's his name? Billy, Billy Baker. Bill Baker. Yeah, Bill Baker. Let me see who who Bill Baker is. People, don't don't be. It, it's say, come to the show. Come in. There's a hotline right here. Say it. Say it. Bill, Bill, Baker. Breaker, Breaker, Breaker. Breaker. Yeah, Bill Breaker, he like a, is he like a break dancer? Is that, is that what it is? He like break dancer this nah, dude? Bill Breaker? I don't know. This dude has yeah. like a weird bald face, like a bald headed? Yeah. That bald headed uh, uh, character in there? Yeah. Don't make me call the wrong You talking about the, 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 Shrek, the Shrek lookalike? He like a Shrek lookalike with, no, with that, that little phone, little here and here. You called the wrong bill, bro. You know, I messed up the other day, and I had the wrong Call Henry? Yo, I, I tried to call a guy named Henry, and then I called the wrong Henry, and then I had Henry here for like 10 minutes, and I'm like, dude, bye, 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 and then like, what? And then I told Henry. I said, Henry, so what happened in the DJ Smiley uh, birthday uh, batch? He said, I don't know, dude. I wasn't even there. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. He's like, Yo, what happened, DJ? Smiley. He's like, I don't know, dude. I wasn't even there. I'm like, who? Who am I calling here? Calling the wrong Henry. I we ain't never spoke to the right Henry. Hold on, let me call this dude. Hope you got the the right dude. Bill Breaker. Nah, Bill. Bill. Bill don't want to come through. Oh, like, like these people, they're talking all like, you know, like, that you know, smack. You don't want come on the phone. That's why I love my people, bro. That's why I love my Angelo. I love my Frankie Cutlass. I love my Rocky Ramos. I love my Ricky Taylor because these people come through. I love my, my I love my the wrong Henry. I love the, the wrong Henry. It's like coming through, <clears throat> but these people don't come through. Like, they, no, come through, son. Come through the hunt. Bill might still be with, he might be still in the closet. That's what it is. Bill's probably in the closet too, and he doesn't know how to come out of the closet. So he ain't just gonna call over here and say, Hey Bernardo, this was going on because he don't wanna be exposed to that he's a closet freak. No. But, uh, Victoria, can we kiss Victoria here for a little while? <laughs> Enough. Kisses for for Victoria. Where Victoria? Let me call Victoria. Victoria, can we call you? Let's have a little Victoria moment over here. Let's have a little Victoria moment. Where Victoria? At? Hold on. Oh, I, I I have one. I have one too. to call. Maybe maybe she can come on the on the. Oh yeah. Victoria wants to come too. Let's say hi to Victoria. Nah, Victoria I don't want to. Who 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 did you say, sir? Well, there's something going on in the freestyle for phonies. Uh, hey, uh, hey, Billy, we were talking about this a little while ago, remember? Um, yes, yes, you're talking about Nancy Ramirez. She is she is fighting with someone she's calling a fake and a phony. His name is Jim Ruiz. He's a fake DJ called DJ Jamito. Uh, that he no. goes around trying to bully people yeah. and think he's a tough dude no. and he wants everybody to 
shut him down, shut him, shut him down. That's the bad dude. We need to get hurt. Yeah, those people. We don't bully people. Yeah, we don't bully people. No, and, and, and I consider Jim a, a very dangerous uh, guy. This this particular, I don't know who he is. He's not a, fa a freestyle, whatever. But you know, I know that it did happen. This really did happen. Somebody went to a police department and actually, uh, you know, did something. Something happened there. Something happened. I did receive. I didn't receive it myself. Uh, my lifelong companion received it. And uh, it was the cops. And I, I don't know what, you know, you know. You talking about 5 0 5 0 to 5 0 that they be running up on the block? The Popo did call. The Popo did call. Oh, my. The Popo called. And uh, it's crazy because I'm going to, you know, it's the Popo from uh, the four, the four St. Lucie. And I'm, I want to be able to call the Popo over there. And I want to be able to go and make a, like a, Like, 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 yo, what's up, people? Like, this is the way the professional law enforcement, United States professional law enforcement, this is the way they, that we're rocking it right now. Like, you call people on the phone. Hey, 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 I have a question, Bernardo. Um, Sir, it, this, this, it, this one did this really person... happen. This one did really happen. No, I don't want to call yeah, this, this. I don't want to call Mr. Ruiz. I don't want to call this per person. Oh, no, but what I'm saying is, did he say anything to you? What, look, what I saw was this guy, I don't know who he is. I don't know who he is. I know it's a bunch of people over here. And then he's trying to get me, like, to go live with him and this and that. And I don't have time to go on live to anybody. All I have time to do is to go my job, Uber, Uber Eat, and now I upgraded. Now I'm postmating. And... Um, That's it. It's job. Come to my house. And this is what I do. I'm not singing at this particular moment. So I'm doing my freestyle crisis center. Right. And uh, I really, I can't go live. All I can do is just go live on our show. So, you know, I think he, this particular person got upset. Next thing I know, he's on a live feed with a, with a lady. And next thing I know, the next day, my love life, my long life companion next day is receiving a phone call from the Poor St. Lucie Police Department saying that I got a restraining order. Dude. That's upsetting. It's upsetting. I would do. Upsetting that the... Uh, They want to... Um, so, let, let, me, let me tell you, Bernardo, about, about the way the law works, okay? The way the law works is you must have intentionally committed some type of crime and you ain't committing no crime. What you got is a bunch of people who are down there, they bored, they ain't got nothing better to do, they looking for some drama, they're trying to actually use you to uh, uh, to create some drama with you so that way they can turn around and get their little Facebook live show up and that's all I have to do it. I want to get my face, I want to get my Facebook number popping. I'm gonna go ahead and bash Bernardo. I'm gonna go to war with Bernardo, and I'm gonna get my face up. I've seen the guy Jim uh, uh, uh live feed. He had like 10, 15 people looking in. He was wasting his breath. It wasn't even. It wasn't even no reason for me to be on. What I would do since I seen the video, and I'm gonna say my input. And Bernardo, take this how you want this, okay? I heard the man say. He was going to punch you in the face. What I would do now, because that's a threat and that's bullying, I I would go to the police department and say, I'm being cyberbullied and arrest them for threatening and bullying you. But if, if I did something like that, basically I'm contradicting myself. I will not do that because... The idea, this is a fun show. The idea is that we're here having fun. So I'm not going to do that because we're having fun, man. You know, this is just a fun show, man. We're making a fun show. I think we're doing great. This is something I've been a part of many uh, crazy, uh, uh, crazy creative stuff. But this one is the most crazy. And it's just a show, you know, and it's, uh, I'm not going to do that. I got a call here from somebody. Guess who's calling? Guess who's calling? Who's calling? The who? wrong Henry is calling. The wrong Henry. Hold on. <laughs> Mr. Good evening. Welcome to the Freestyle Crisis Center. 
Mr. Henry? What's up? What's up, party people in the place to be? What's up, Billy? What's up, Billy? What's up, Michael? What's up, guys? What up, up Billy? What's going on, man? Yeah. Henry? No, man, I'm out in the back, man. I'm not even in the crib, so I don't got no crazy, wacky special effects today, yo. I just finished doing a compra, and I wait for my man to come out the store, so I said, let me ch chime in and see what's going on, man. What's the, what's the latest crisis? Yeah, we got a lot of, uh, crisis is like, uh, right. like a lot of men flirting, like men flirting yeah. with, flirt with men and shit like that, like crazy shit. I don't know, son. No. Yeah, like wow. Uh, I know this. A I lot mean, of people. A lot. You, know, you like, never know. Yeah, you don't know what the topic is to be. A lot of people coming out of the closet this day. That's the crisis. <laughs> yeah, they were first. They were oh, first. They were first know, trapped they're in the closet, the closet, and now they're getting out of the closet. Be, out of the closet. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah. Well, you know what? We gotta push the motherfucking asses back in the closet. <laughs> Nah, man. Push them right back in. Our you know, Kelly, our Kelly straps in the closet. I'm yeah. there. You know me. You know me, Bernardo. I got ideas. Okay, sure. I got an idea, man. Because sure, sure. maybe because that guy that had the the uh, stop and shop concert, the stop and shop concert yes, with sir. the with the, that shit was funny, by the way. Very creative, man. Very, very funny. Funny. I was I was laughing my ass off. So. Oh, I was thinking because you know I want to. I just want to clear something up because um I'm the the fe emphasis on the wrong Henry. I'm not wrong Henry. Because some people were like getting getting it mixed up like wrong Henry. Because like, that gives the impression that I'm wrong. You know what I'm saying? So we gotta clear that up. I'm the wrong Henry, and we all know the story behind that, right, Billy? Well, how did that happen? <laughs> we know the story. That was a blooper. That was a phone call blooper. <laughs> and and uh, so we wanted to clear that up. It's the Henry. Yes, sir. And so if we got the wrong Henry, if I was to become a promoter, right? Yes, sir. Like this guy who promoted the Stop the Shop concert, this or that, I could promote the wrong freestyle artists. Like I could promote. The wrong body quapasi. I could I could promote the wrong TK. I could promote the wrong a whole fucking a whole line of, of wrong artists that 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 are that are, that are in conflict. That's what best crazy. promoter than to have the wrong Henry? Henry, that's too crazy, bro. <laughs> yeah, yo, think about it. The wrong Henry, the wrong Amaretto, the wrong TKA, the wrong body quapasi. Everybody say, oh, they not the original, they not. So let's fucking have a concert with the wrong people. I like, that's very I like that. Henry things the way I think. I like that. That's a concept on its own right there. Hey, hey Henry. Henry. I just, you know, they can all bring me that lawyer. People. <laughs> I have a big fucking crisis fest. I like that. <laughs> oh, shit. I like that. Hey, man, that's, that's my type of. I love, I love the little five minutes that you let me have on your show to, to bring the goofiness. That's, that's what I love doing, you know. Oh, check this out. Freestyle, freestyle music was good to me. It was good to me. You want to tell you why it was good to me today? Freestyle music? Uh huh. I sold, because you know I buy and sell vinyl, right? Yes, sir. I, I, so I made quite a few, I made today freestyle for a buyer. I'm a buyer. I found someone Henry. fucking yeah. order for 12 inch of vinyl. I sold I double. I'm some good today. Freestyle was good to me today, bro. Yeah. In 2019, yeah. You break, October. Mister, mister, you're breaking up. But thank you, Henry. You know you are a, a family member of the Freestyle Crisis Center. Thank you, sir. All right. Thank you, man. Thank you. All right, guys. So let, I'm, let's be clear right here. Whenever we... He's not wrong, Henry. He's not wrong. He's the wrong Henry. We have that clear? No. Oh, okay. Okay, but now he's the wrong Henry. The wrong Henry. You're wrong with the with the duh. D D A duh. Yeah, people <laughs> call the crease out the hotline right here. The the hotline is right here. Call us up whenever the phone number comes out. 
Okay, so um, what else we got for today, people? Oh, there he goes. There hey, we go. hey, Billy, remember when Mr. Wrong Henry was saying that lineup? He said, he said that they talking about <laughs> we, we can put on something like that. Put on a wrong TK, but have everybody that's the opposite. The opposite of the real, and we have a concert. The opposite of from the real to the wrong. I like that shit. The, the fake, the fake TK, uh, the 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 wannabes, all them guys like that. That's the good. I like that concept. I like that. I like that concept a lot, bro. I like that concept. So let me ask you a question, guys. Let me call Rocky. Before we for yo, hold on a second. What time is it? What time does Michael fall asleep? <laughs> I wasn't sleeping. I was just taking but a nap. You was just taking a nap, people. Michael's alone says that he was not sleeping, <laughs> that he was just taking now, an, an 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 eight hour nap. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here! <laughs> you see, you guys were like putting me to sleep. Because these guys weren't talking when change All right, so okay, so let's call let's let's call Rocky. Rocky, Rocky, you got the hottest story of the night, man. He's not even calling, bro. I gotta get him on the phone, man. I wanna call Zeke. Hello. Alright. DJ Do the wrong Henry, not wrong Henry. All right, all right, people. So, okay, people. So, all right, let's call Seek. Let's call Seek. Let's I know I can't Zeke. call Seek, bro. I can't call Seek because I don't have him here. Seek, let me see. But you don't have, you don't have, you call him from the hotline. Let me see, hold on one second. Nah, because I don't know his number, bro. Uh, let me get it. You just, you just, you just tell somebody uh, in the chat room, you know, just from your people know Seek. Um, to call it, he knows the number, man. He knows what's going on. He knows he can reach out. He, he failed several times to reach out to the Bernardo show because he does not want to acknowledge all the bad doing that he's doing. So that's that's all games with him, man. He's playing games going back and forth. He knows what he's doing. Rocky, let me read, let me read you Rocky Ramos' uh, press release. Right, today's press release. Busy in the lab, working on the next hit. Got off the phone with some famous, someone famous who wants to collab. Business first. That means that he's not. Yeah, I like this shit, bro. Like, people, like, I like this right here. This shit sounds legit. This shit sounds like gangster. You sure you don't do coke? Like Coca Cola? I do Coca Cola. Let's call Angela. Hold on. Let's mess, with, let's mess with Angela for a little while. Hold on. Oh, oh I, hold on. I can call Seek. Hold on. I'm calling Seek. Who is calling Seek? Call Seek. The answer is. Nah, Seek don't want to answer. Okay. So, uh, uh, Angelo, Angelo, Angelo. Where Angelo at? Okay, Angelo. Let's call Angelo. Yo. Angelo, sir, uh, how are you, bro? I'm good. How you doing? Okay, so uh, you, uh, I, so I, I, read, I just read a comment. I'm about to roll my shit. Yo, I just read a comment from you and said, you said, Bernardo, you sure you don't do like Coke? Is, you, you referred to Coca Cola? Yeah, man. Because I was trying to put two and two together because you was loving the fuck out of, um, what's her name? You forgot Moreto. You was loving the fuck out of her. So I was like, damn, he must do Coke too. He lives in Miami. Get it for cheap. Yeah. You got to take a bump here and there. Do you? Nah, son. I, this is me right here. Look. Starbucks. I do. I do my coffee. I take yeah, coffee. Yeah, that's that Cuban coffee, right? Yeah. Well, now I'm rocking. Like a Tony it. Montana special. I'm rocking it to Starbucks. From the mountains of Tony. Yeah, I'm doing this, but I do. Uh, uh, I do my Bustelo in the morning. I got my whole oh, over man. here, so I rock a Bustelo. You sniff Bustelo? That's crazy. I never heard of that. Yeah. 
You gotta remember that. You sniffed Mustelo, huh? I, I sniffed Mustelo. Yo, so, 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 what's up, Frankie? Pretty right? I, you know, I, I, I heard, I heard him like a little upset today, man. Listen, man. You know, sometimes you keep up with the bullshit to get people upset. I would be upset too. I was upset at you when you started your bullshit. You was you was upset at me? Yeah, you don't remember the first time I came on the show and I fucking yeah, verbally I abused you? Yeah, I remember that. The, uh, so you out of your character? Yeah. Angelo, the, uh, Sometimes the, you got people arrest, man, and don't call Cynthia. Leave that lady alone, man. That lady's a hardworking lady, man. Give her some respect, man. At least at some point. If she wants to be heard, she call you, bro. Yeah. Angelo, Leave one of the queens alone. Did, did we get that uh, that that shirt? Did, uh, you, uh, we're going to print that shirt so we can make some bread? What shirt? What does that say? Remember the shirt? Calm down. Calm down. The calm down shirt. I don't know, man. Yo, you gotta that's... get permission for that. You're gonna get sued, man. No, I need your permission. The only one. Make... Only... Nah, you, you can't get my permission. You, I can't you know get... whose permission you gotta get for that. Who's you gotta get some sponsors. Tell your people to share, man. I see this the most views you had. You're almost at, I think, 65, 70. That's fucking dope. Yeah. You gotta excuse me. I'm rolling my shit. Yeah, that shit is. Richie Rich, what up, Richie Rich? What up? Yo, your girl Moreno. Victoria, what up? Yo, your girl Moreno just joined Moreno. in. She just joined in, bro. I know, I'm waiting for the, I'm waiting for the, um, them to come knock at my door. Amoretto just chimed in, bro. That's good for her, man. I believe in I saw Amoretto. a video that was online. Could you play that video? I saw it when I was online, her singing. Looks like she was lip syncing. Nah. I saw it online on some page. I forgot what it was. Nah, some phony shit. Amoretto's uh, it's a monster, bro. I'm pretty sure everybody's seen it. I wish everything. Oh, uh, yeah, you show I, I, everything I else, every... right? But you won't show that video? It's not wrong with that. It's her singing. Proves the point, right? Yeah, I wish Amaretto. Uh, I wish. I wish every freestyle artist had that a little bit of that Amaretto feeling inside. Man, we will climb all the way to the top. There's more than a little Amaretto inside that, bro. What are you talking about? Okay. Bro? Yeah, I ain't gonna bring up the subject, but it's more than Amaretto. Amaretto is. It's, I'm gonna get Amaretto on the line. I'm gonna say hi to her. Okay, I'll call you right back. All right, go say hi to her. Man. All right. Shall shall shall, shall I call Amaretto and say hello to her? You would, you would call Bernardo, say hi. You know she's a little sexy little I thing. Call, I gotta call Moreno because Moreno is a family member. She's a family member, bro, of, of our show. You know, yes. and, and she's a great yes, example. She she's a great example. I love her because she's a, you know, an example. Moreno is very, very outspoken, and we love that. <laughs> Oh, she's on the train, she says. I'm on the train. I'm on the train. We got Michael. Michael, Michael says, Michael, Michael. Let's call Michael Lee. Michael, what's up, bro? Michael says, uh, 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 Angelo sounds like a loser. Let's call Michael. Michael. See what's up with Michael Lee. Let's see what's up with Michael Lee. That's my boy. So Michael Lee, Angelo. He's trying to be like a Stanley, uh -huh. like Bruce Lee. He's like a Bruce Lee kind of deal. Watch out, Michael. Nah, no answer from Michael, man. This is the problem with you dealing with these people. Okay? They love to gossip. They love to chit chat. They love to write stuff all up in the chat room. But then when you call them out, when you pull their coat and you say, hey, let me hit you up. And so you can come on here and say your piece. They don't even want to pick up the phone. That to me is just number phony. They number phony. A real player player is going to write what they're going to want to write in the chat room. And they're going to pick up the phone and say, what's going on, Bernard? This is what it is. I got a gripe or I don't got a gripe. How can you know what's going on? But, you know, you just can't get these people, man. They're not, they not genuine. They're not genuine. <laughs> Uh, Michael? No, I got you. Michael! I'm here, I'm here, I'm sorry about Dude. that. We thought he fell asleep again, you know how that joke was there. He fell asleep close to midnight, and, and he was knocked the fuck out. Knocked the 
fuck out. It's called it's called it's called I have a J O B early in the morning. You got a J O B? Yeah, that's 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 called that's called you you was fucked up. You was all I'm jacked the fuck up. You were throwing. You were loud. That was, that was my sound effect. <laughs> you're lucky he wasn't. <laughs> he's lucky he wasn't in jail, Bernardo, because you know what happened. He had been stunned. He had been stunned, and daddy oh, got him. Daddy got him. You would have never heard him uh, breathe no more, no nothing. Cause they would have got him. What do we you know in prison? You know what they do in prison? They they take that shit from you, Bernardo. If you got like a little sweet little thing going on, like maybe you got. You know, you know, you got the, the homophobic up in that beat, and all these homos, and, and you know, you know wrong, but, you know, they'll take you shit, but now you could be a straight all you want. Yo, let me ask you guys something. Is it me, or is there a lot of homophobia going around these days? It's a lot of it's, homophobia. It's, it's, it's America now. It's, it's the American population right now. Girl, girl, guy, guy, all this other stuff. I'm still a straight nigga. This is how I go. I, I keep it real. I'm a straight nigga. You ain't coming at me with all that, because I'm not going for that. But I'm just telling you again, you could be a straight dude all you want. My, my, Go to prison Billy, and find out. Billy Wright. They're going to get that for Billy, me. Billy Wright, let me ask you a question, Billy Wright. So you ain't never looked at a dude out there and say, yo, he's kind of cute. You ain't never said that shit to yourself inside your brain? I'm going to be honest with you. Billy's going to tell you the real truth. I'm going to be real strict with and honest with you. Yeah, I've said it several times. You, i said it again and again. You know why? I was looking in the mirror at myself. I said, God damn, that's all oh, hit my pro oh, really, you just so good. <laughs> I was gonna kiss some French kiss myself. That's how delicious I look. So that so you looked in the mirror and said, hey, Damn, hey, damn, hey. damn, he cute. <laughs> so stop it with this stuff, please. I got a question for both of you lame old. Say it, say it. Listen, who's the top five male? Freestyle artist. Oh. Top five. Top, top five. Top five. I'll give you I'll I'll give you one. Jordan Mark. Go ahead. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. We get now the, who's the top one? Is the top one like like a, representing like the king or something? The I mean king. I just want to know every time. Right. Yeah. Okay, so, the, top five. The top five. So, so the top see. one is the king and the five is, oh, okay, okay, let's let's play. Yeah. Okay, let's and, play. And, and, any order, any order. Okay, so you said no, no. The, the, the one is the top. The top one is the king, right? Is that what we call? The top one is the king. So we we say George Lemon is in there somewhere in the top five, and then Coro is top in there. Coro is in there. Coro is in there. Who else? Mm -hmm. We going we gonna go with um. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You say, no, wait, 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 you can jump it too quick because that's that's. That's a no-brainer. Let's let's kiss her. I mean, you know, we should go to top ten. No, no, no. We should do the we should do five of the top and then five that are are, are, are good but they're not at the super top. No, look, this is my at least this is my top five. My top five. Okay. End them with the king. Okay. Uh, uh George Lemon, I would say uh K seven, I would say Coro, I would say uh Suave, and then the king. The number one freestyle dude, the king of freestyle himself, Mr. Stevie B. That's the shit right there. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to go with you, Bernard, on that one. Stevie B is the king, and, and, and that is true. I mean, we can't take that from him. He is the king, and you, and you said that on the Bernard Show. We, we support 100% Stevie B as the king of freestyle. freestyle. We support. There's nobody so above. There's this, nobody above this. This five right here. This is the four or five G's of freestyle. George Lemon, the K seven guy, the 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 uh, what's his name? The Swabe guy. Coral, the Swabe guy, <laughs> and the the king, the king himself, the king, the only king the freestyle has. His name is Stevie B. Somebody in the chat said. Johnny the King. Let's call that guy Ricky. <laughs> yeah. No, John. No, Johnny, no John, 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 he is not. He is not a king. He's not a queen. 
He ain't anything. Oh, the man, the man is Johnny, none of the above. I'm gonna put him in the Johnny top was, twenty. Johnny has, you know, some some uh some some, yeah, no. some yeah, freestyle no. songs, but you know, like King King, like royalty, no. Okay. No, no, he's nowhere near that. No, no, really. he's nowhere near that. He never will be there. No, he's not. He's not getting paid like that. Like Stevie B. Stevie, no. Stevie B. goes on 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 stage. A man's making close to anywhere from twelve to twenty thousand. This other guy, what he what he getting like 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 two hundred two two thousand dollars compared to like twelve thousand eighteen thousand. That Stevie's getting. No, that's the king, At bro. Least I I give you know I give recognition to to Johnny as one one of the uh, one, uh just a freestyle artist. You know, like uh, any of us. You know, I'm a freestyle artist, but no, like, like, like royalty. No, I, I, I wouldn't mention him as, had, as royalty. He's had help with the one song that everybody listens to. Exactly. To the, the the reason why is because Green of the Cynthia. Girl. Yeah, Cynthia. The Cynthia hookup. That's you, what makes him. You might listen to it, but Billy, Billy don't listen to that because that 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 track doesn't doesn't do anything for Billy. I'd rather go listen from so from Suave. Crying over you. It's all I can do when I love someone new. We're crying over you. That's what we got to listen to Suave. Because that, let me tell you, the Suave comes out in a suit and tie. He looking fly. He out there putting on a show. Mike? Yo, I got to get me a mic like that. He might. He's up there. Yo, you saw the mic? That's a mic I need. Suave, Suave is just a, like he said, that's why he called him Suave, because the man is smooth. So he, he's got to be up in the top five, but, you know, that's what happens when you're dealing with this freestyle that everybody wants to go all the way to the top, they want to be the king, this won't be that one, that's the man. Suave is the man. Listen to a guy here who says, TKA is the Puerto Rican Beatles. That's some crazy <laughs> shit. Oh that God. is some crazy ass shit. The which, TKA, which 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 TKA you got? You got K Seven and the Swing Kids, and then you got AB uh, AB Tony and and what's the other one, man? It's all messed what? up. See, those are the things why I do. this is all jacked up because you can't say TKA. We got a phone. We got a we, we got a phone right. We got a call right here. Uh, good evening, sir. The, welcome to the Freestyle Crisis Center. How can we help you today? Hi, right, what's going on, Bernardo? What's up, my bro? What's going on? It's me, Danny, right, right here from the what's ATA. Up? What's up, my bro? How are you tonight, bro? <laughs> hey, I see all this bullshit going on, man. What the fuck is the problem, man? Okay. Everybody's okay. bullshitting, everybody in the feelings and shit. Yeah. Ah, crazy, bro. Nah. Hey, real talk, though, Bernardo, you, you, got, you got my support, bro. But all I want to say is, man, all these niggas that, all these people that, they're tripping over, I don't know, bullshit, they out of the mind, man. Fuck they are, that. They are tripping. A lot of people tripping over here. And, uh, you know, they don't know how to, how, they, they don't know how to, you know, just tripping, bro, you know, instead of just like. You can see right, you can, you can see right through the skirt. That's what you can say. <laughs> the skirt. I like that. You can see yeah. right through the skirt. I'm gonna keep I'm gonna put that one on the script from now on. You can see right through the skirt. I like that shit. Guys. There you go. There you go from Danny. Michael. <laughs> hold on. Michael and uh Billy. Any yeah. question? Yeah. No, nah, I don't have no question. What do you what do you think of that? I you I could see right through the skirt. You can see right through the skirt. <laughs> I like that shit. <laughs> If you can see right through the skirt, what do you see? <laughs> a bitch. A bitch. I don't see right through the skirt. You ain't wearing pants. You ain't wearing pants. You ain't wearing pants. You ain't a dude. <laughs> you ain't a dude. Michael, isn't that right? I like that shit. <laughs> hey, Bernardo, I love you, brother, Thank for you, real. Brother. Thank you, my bro. Thank you for calling me today. Take care, my bro. Yeah. Be more like Danny and call and say hello. Say hello. Be more like Danny. Yo, I like that. I can see right through your skirt. Billy Wright, Billy Wright, I can see right through your skirt. Your accent don't 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 you're hiding in that accent of yours. Billy Wright! This is this is this is Billy Wright. Oh little Billy. 
who gave that kid the phone? He must have taken from Billy Ray. That's his son. No, no kids allowed over here. No kids allowed over here. Mister, can you go and get and give your mom the phone, sir? We don't allow kids over here. Where's your mother, sir? Where's your mom? What is she doing? I don't like that shit. Her mom, your mom is in the room, and what is she doing there? What is she doing in the room? Is, is somebody with her there? Is somebody with your mom in the room, sir? Young young man, I don't like yes. this. Who's in the room with your mom? A guy named Leroy and Tyrone are in the room with your mom? Yes, we are. Oh, it's well, that could be um the uh exercise, the 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 instructors, the uh, can you hear so could, could you hear some uh uh uh, uh, exercise instructions in there. That could be that. Like uh, one, two, three, four. Young. I want to get you on the floor. <laughs> could you hear? Could you hear that? Is that? It could. Yeah. It could be the. Oh, 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 Sumba with Tyrone, <laughs> Tyrone and, and, and Leroy. Don't sound like no Zumba to me. We hear your mom screaming. L little Billy. If you say, if you say, oh Billy, oh Billy, oh Billy. That don't sound like. Can you say, oh Billy? Can you? I know you want to talk about. Oh, she's not talking about me. She's in there for me, and she. I believe she's sitting on something else because I'm off for school. What did he say? <laughs> What did he say, Michael? What did he say, Michael? I just didn't want to do it. 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 But mommy's mouth is all full, so she can't talk to me. I don't understand that, Michael. Could you, could you repeat that for me? Because I don't understand what he's saying. He said that his mommy's mouth is so full that, it, that it, he, she can't talk to him. Oh, well, kid, get off the phone, sir. Kid, get off the phone. phone okay don't touch your mom's phone okay hang it up right now hang it up okay. really hang it up hang it up okay. don't touch your mom's phone yeah, okay. and leave your mom alone because she's in there exercising with Leroy and Tyrone and go to sleep it's go to sleep it's past your bedtime hold on I got a phone call kid hang up the phone kid hold on let me get this phone call <laughs> 
Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. No, no, no. Get off the phone. Well, I got a phone call over here, kid. Get off the phone. Hold on. Yeah, good, good evening. Good evening. Welcome to the free, uh, free South Crisis Center. Kid, get off the phone. Get off the phone. Get off. I mean, uh, you got puppets over there. No, it's just some, going on over there? Some, some, some kid that took the mom's phone and she's you in the room with Tyrone. Kids, grown kids um, talking <laughs> like babies. Yo, this, she, he took anyway, the phone. Anyway, yeah, I don't think Stevie B is the king of freestyle. You know why? One uh, thing why is because he's pop. Every time they put a, a, a song on Stevie B in New York City, people get off the dance floor. It's a love song. We go way back into New York City, Devil's Nest, La Mirage, with India, Noel, George Lamont, the Zemmer Lenders. Mm -hmm. Freestyle is a dance thing. Stevie B is a love thing. Mm -hmm. You know, that's what that's what that's my input. And how about like like uh party your body and spring love and all that stuff? I mean, he was commercial. He's commercial. No, I think what he did was he Josh Lamont Josh Lamont was also was going commercial but he never made it to that point. But he made good videos, better videos than Stevie B. Yeah, but George Lamont, you could you could hear him on the on the clubs, and you respect him as a as a as a dance. You know, you could you you could dance to that to that music. Stevie B is mostly like uh, romantic. Me mm -hmm. I don't know. I like that's my opinion. George Lamont is. Uh... I mean, that, that's, that's mostly like Florida thing. Yeah, you know, freestyle Florida is different from New York City Florida. Like, one thing agree? I, yeah, yes. And one thing I do, I do, I think that, I don't know why George Lamont doesn't get, like, the rec like more recognition than the one that he has. Because, to be honest with you, I think the best freestyle singer ever is George Lamont. Like, singer. That guy is a real singer. Like, a well, real good singer. He, he, he performs good. He, he, his voice is awesome. And um, his, um, like, his tracks are, like... Top notch, more well, top notch compared to anybody. I mean, any other freestyle. I mean, Suave is good. He only got one hit, but that's it. But that's a great hit. You know, it is what it is. That's a great hit. What do you, you think? Of, what do you think of this new? But Lizette Melendez is also another great artist. Cynthia, great artist. They, 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 they make dance music, like you know, like really for the freestyle. Uh, Crowd. Crowd. Me entiende? Yeah. So, I mean, I mean, Miami is different. I, I think you're in Miami, right? Yeah, I'm in Miami. I'm in Miami, Florida. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're in Miami. A lot of New Yorkers go to Miami and they come back and forth and stuff like that. Yeah. But, uh, you know, but uh, I think that's that's where it stands. You know, I, you can't compare Miami sound to New York sound. It's, what? It's not going to. Yeah, go ahead. I'm listening to uh, uh, a kid. His name is George Anthony. I'm liking him a lot. George Anthony, the, oh, oh, that duet that he did with, uh, uh, with George, George Lamont. Lamont. I like that. That's hot. That's hot. That's hot. Yeah. That's hot. You know what it is? Is because George Lamont introduced it, it, introducing um, new up and coming artists, and um, the music sound hot. Yeah. I mean, I, I'm an old school nigga. You know, like going back in the days, Palladium. Like I say. Uh, Shanghai Reds, New York City, you know, back in the days. When I hear music, that, I'm like, oh, wow, this has, like, a good taste. ¿Me entiende? Yeah. Let, let me also, you know, now, I, that, now that you're, 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 you're saying this, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking, and I'm, you know, all the things that I've been thinking all these days, like, for example, the ladies of Freestyles are looking hot these days, bro. Cynthia's looking like a doll, bro. She's beautiful, bro. Cynthia's Julie Torres right. is an amazing voice. She came out, I think she, she's from the Bronx also, from Valentine's, Paul Park, just sorry, Boogie Down, mm -hmm. you know, and uh, she, and she, and she has a Broadway show, so it does, um, um, se llama esta tipa? Uh, Trina? 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 Trina. Yeah, yeah, she's amazing. 
amazing, amazing voice. Yep. And those are the artists that you need to promote a little bit more. Yep. Yep. You should you reach out to them. Yeah. Thank you, my friend. Thank you for, for calling us, okay? We, we love hey, to hey, you. Thank you for, yeah. Thank you for being a, a friend of the free <laughs> Corona. Okay, bye. Yo. Yo, what's up? Where am I go at? I'm right here, I'm right here. Where Billy at? I don't know, but I'm scared that little kid got that phone still. Look, look, Bill Breaker, like, why does he, what, what was the question we have for Bill Breaker? Um, I don't remember now. I'll come back to me, give me a second. I don't remember what we wanted, Bill Breaker. Bill Breaker, you're wanted right here in the Freestyle Crisis Center for some. Uh... But hold on, before he before he even calls in, we got to find out from Billy. Billy might know what it what, what, what was it again. Billy, right? Frankie, my bro, you okay? Frankie, Frankie, Frankie came through today. Frankie, he was hot. He was hot. He was hot. Frankie was hot today. Try calling Zeke again. Nah, I don't want to call Seek. We're done with Seek already. Come on. Nah, Seek don't want to pick up the phone. Nah, I don't want to start that beef. We don't want to go that route. Nah. We'll leave it for some other time. Where, 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 yeah. where, where are we right at? Probably in the bathroom again. Look, love Cynthia. Yeah, we love Cynthia. Cynthia but is looking beautiful. Am Cynthia is Yo, Amaretto, beautiful. Amaretto, Amaretto, we should make an event and charge tickets. We should make a what? An event and charge tickets. Oh, we oh yeah, well, that's what we're looking. That's what we're looking to do. We need to take the Freestyle Crisis Center on the road and take everyone, including Amaretto, because Amaretto is a family member of the Freestyle Crisis Center. Baby Amaretto, if I had <laughs> bread, let me tell Baby Amaretto something. If I had bread to invest in freestyle, I would invest it in you. I would invest it in Frankie Cutlers. I would invest it in Freestyle Riggy. I would invest it in. No, Rocky they're Rado. going. They're going at it in the chat. Amaretto and Frankie. They, they go, said Frankie in the yeah, game. Yeah, they going. They going Amaretto. Yeah, but they going at no. it because they're they're entertainers. That's what I like about them. No. They're real entertainers. No, but Amaretto said Frankie, you didn't get your ass with. He said you're a pathetic liar. <laughs> They, I love them. Yeah. Like they're entertainers, bro. I wouldn't. I wouldn't risk my money in some artist, you know, singing some song. No, I would invest my money in in artists that can sing, just like for example, Amaretto can sing, and uh, you know, Rocking can sing. Shit, I could even make Freestyle Ricky sing. I could do that. You know what I'm saying? But the character behind them people, I love that because the world is lacking of leaders in a world full of followers. We need some leaders. And Frankie is a leader. Amaretto is a leader. Yeah, she's talking about suing now. Suing. Sue him. Do it. <laughs> 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 All right, guys. So I think we've done enough time today. I think it was good. And, um, you know, we'll, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll yeah. Mister? I'm, I'm still awake. You're still here. So let's, let's, let, we all got to go to sleep. I got to go Uber Eat tomorrow. I got to go Uber. I got to go Uber Eat. I got, and I branched out. I'm doing a uh, Postmate now. So, um, so let's, let's, let, we're done for tonight. So, uh, we'll see, you know, and we come back later on in the week. Uh, cause that's what we got. We got a lot of, fr call Moretto. Let's call Moretto before we go. Let's call, call Moretto. Call Amaretto. Let's call Moretto. Let's call Amaretto. Let's call Amaretto. Hold on. Amaretto. Amaretto. I'm Bobby. Okay, somebody's calling. Oh, Frankie's calling. Oh, shit. Frankie's calling. Okay. Frankie, how are you, bro? Yeah, hey, what's up, man? What's up, my bro? Yo, why, why, do you, why do you give this woman so much shine, bro? That, that woman's a pathetic liar, <laughs> man. <laughs> What the hell's wrong with you giving that woman shine like that, man? I like her, bro. You, Frankie, you know why? I'm going to tell you why. She told us on the show about uh, last week sometime, I'm not going to lie, she said that she's going to court right now for the right of her being on those songs. 
Bro, let, let me say something. I spoke to Ray Serrano's wife. Ray okay. still owns Ray still owns the name Amaretto. He's 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 going through some illness right now. He's trying to fight that illnesses. Um, but his wife is the one that's taking over everything right now, and he owns the name Amaretto. He still does. He owns the masters and everything to that track. The real singer behind that track. Listen, I, and I'm not knocking whatever that lady's name, J Lo, whatever her name is. I'm not saying that she was in part of the group, and I'm not, I'm not saying she was not in the cover. But she is not the lead singer. She's not. It's Jeanette de Jesus. She's the lead singer of that song. Do you understand me? Mm -hmm. Stop giving this woman too much shine. She's a pathetic liar. The girl lies about everything, Frankie, bro. Frankie, she's good for show. She's very good. She's an entertainer. Like, okay, she's fine. But that doesn't mean that she's the lead singer of a song that she's claiming to be. She's not the lead singer, bro. Just like the guy Boricua Posse. He doesn't gotta... sing your fellas Boricua. That's my boy Flex. Flex is the rapper behind that. The web I'm in, the Kiss Connection are the creative of that song, Boricua Posse. Victor and Donnie, um, Don, uh, Donnie Vega. Uh, Don, Don, Don yeah. Vega. Yeah. They're, the they're the creator of that song, not not no freaking whatever that dude's name that he's going out there singing that song. This is what I'm thinking. I'm thinking, for, at least for me, this is what I want to create. I want to be able to create, and I want to be able to, uh, at least when it comes to me, uh, pinpoint and, and, and stand out people who, people who stand out. And I believe uh, uh, Moreto, Jay Lopez, she stands out as an entertainer. I'm into entertainers, and she's an entertainer. Okay, just, but there's nothing. Just as you no, are. Listen, you all right, are. fine. She can entertain. She can entertain, you know. But I'm not saying she, but you know, you can't, you can't sit there and I, allow her to say that she sings the record because she doesn't sing the record, bro. You got to stop that, bro. She does not sing the record. She's not the original singer. She has nothing to do with that record. You know, maybe she did the key, little key here, little something there, but she's not the lead singer. She's not the lead right. singer of the song. No. Just like there's a lot of imposter in this freestyle. We got to start, we got Listen, man, we got to start telling the people the truth, man, because this is this this freestyle genre, man. It's going somewhere else. And by, by the time two, three years from now, this, this not going to be no more freestyle. It's discontinued. Discontinued. This is going to be another disco. Yeah. I believe in our genre. I think we're doing good. Let me call Moreto. Let's see what she has to say. Oh, my God. Let's Forget see. about it. I'm, I'm done. <laughs> I'm done now. Forget about it. Forget about it. I'm done. Right. I'm done now. Forget oh, about it. Oh, Frankie, Frankie. Let me go. We're no, gonna go. Oh, man. You, you just love that crazy <laughs> shit, bro. You I love, love to talk. He's a great... Man. I love her. Hold on. He's a great... You mean a great freaking liar, nah, man. She... Please. Okay. Hold on one second. Let me call her. Hold on. All right, baby, I'm a red I believe in I'm a red bro. I believe in all my I believe in all my people, bro. Oh no, bro. Frankie got Frankie got some some full connect, bro. Yo, I believe in my bro. I believe in my people. Let me call my Amaretto, my baby here. I love this girl. Hold on. I'm a red I'm a red Okay. Let's try to keep the cursing a little glug, 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 because Let's see if she wants to answer. I think Billy woke up from his nap. I'm already don't want to answer. I'm already, mommy, you don't want to answer, baby? Hey, 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 welcome back from your nap. Yeah. I got a guy here that says, I got a, I got a guy here that says Johnny O is the king. No, Johnny O is a singer. Well, at least to me, he's not the king. He's just a singer. The king is CBB. He's a singer. He's, a, you know, one of the... Big. Yeah, one of the great singers. Mm, so. I love me some Stevie, some 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 Stevie. Mm. I love me some Stevie. King, king, Stevie, king, king, king. Let's call Maria. Call again. Call again. Call again. Call again. Hold on. Hold on. Hold again. Oh, oh you shoot. just missed it, Billy. Oh shoot! I'm a red one. Billy, you missed it. Oh, we missed. We just had Frankie Cutler on okay. the phone. Again? Hi, Mama Moreto. How are you? Hi, how are you? Hi. How are you doing can tonight? Can you hear me? I, we can hear you just fine. Como tu estas okay. hoy? Say it again. Como tu estas hoy? How are you today? 
I'm okay hanging in there, you know, doing my usual errands, work, the whole thing, you, you know. You in the studio these days? Are you working at the studio? You doing something? Yeah, I was um, getting a show tape together. I have a couple of shows lined up. I'm trying to get my new song perfect for my show tape. When are you going to come to Florida and visit us over here? Before well, we can talk about that. But I'd like to address... This Frankie Cutlass and the people that keep believing the lies, calling me the liar. Can I say what I have to yes, say before my phone cuts off? Yes, okay, listen. I never in my lifetime spoke to Frankie Cutlass about anything related to Amaretto. I never told that fucking guy that I sang the lead. I don't know where he's coming from. I always said there was three women. I always said it was me, Jeanette, and a girl named Annette. Now I hear there's a saray on the record. So I'm going to court now. I'm filing the lawsuit, and Frankie Cutlass's name is all over it. And whoever wants to join in and say their two cents, I'm going to screenshot their comments and throw them in the lawsuit so they can be deposed also. Because if you think you know so fucking much, why did you look up the case? We already went to court for the name Amaretto. I was proven I'm one of the original girls. And now I'm going to prove who's on the song Clave Rock. Because I know I sing that intro. That's me. The hot cha. I puppy. The beat. The heat. Rhythm. Passion. You and me. I puppy. I sing that. I wrote those two words. I puppy. The song was originally written in the key of A. And I couldn't sing it in that key. I told Ray, let's transpose it to my key. The key of G. It turns out he couldn't transpose the music. I often wondered where the fuck he got the music. He couldn't move it around. It was all pre recorded we thought he stole it it turns out jose prieto wrote clave rock not ray serrano you could go look up the copyrights if you like people and he didn't give me the credit for the i poppy the two words that's fine because now he's gonna have to give me the credit because now i'm gonna sue Fuck it. You people want to keep talking shit about me, not knowing the case? It already went through court. Now I'm going to go through court for Clave Rock. We're going to get those masters. We're going to prove who the fuck is on the record. All I'm trying to prove is that I was on the record. In some form or fashion, I did sing, whether it's a small piece or the intro, whatever, it shows I'm on the record. That's all I'm trying to prove. They trying to say I'm not on the record at all, that I came in 1989. And that's impossible, because by by 1989, freestyle was already fading away, pretty much. By the 90s, it was over. So, Frankie Cutlass, you can go fuck yourself, nigga, because I'm coming after you, you motherfucker. You ruined my fucking career, you bitch. Talking shit about me, you bitch. No promoter wants to talk to me because of your fat ass. Well, guess what? You're going to be deposed. You better show up in court, you motherfucker. Right. No, thank you, mommy. Thank you. You're a friend of this. Of, of I our never people. denied that there was other girls. I always said there was two other girls. But you motherfuckers want to turn it around because you know what? I was ahead of my time. And one last thing. Let me tell you something. If I get through this, I'm going to redefine fucking Latin freestyle because that's where I was going. But it looks like with all the hate, I was not supposed to come back. It was done in such a way that I was not supposed to come back. But I came back, and that's what they're all pissed off, that I came back. So whatever plans you motherfuckers had for Amaretto, I came back, bitches. Fuck y'all. Thank you, mommy. Whoa. What was that all about? Stop bullying. What was that all about? Michael. He's a bully. Michael. Billy. I'm here. Where Billy at? Billy somewhere. I think he fell back to sleep. That's pretty crazy, right? That shit was I'm crazy. right over there and I'll be bullying. Yo, that shit was pretty wild. Billy. Billy. Billy back. Um, that shit was pretty uh, wild. Question. Right? Can you ask you something about the low key causing early? Who? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, little little kid called it over there. I don't know. He said his name was Little Billy. Was that your son? Yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. All I know is I, I fell asleep for like a minute, and, and, and I heard something through, through, the, through, the, through the, the Facebook, 
You know, you know, we got a trauma. I just wanted to find out. But that was on my letter. She seemed like she wasn't too happy. She was not happy at all. Billy, let me ask you a question. Are you under any kind of uh, uh, medication, like, like over, over, <laughs> over, the, over the counter uh, medication, or maybe? Sometimes, sometimes I have like these back problems that my my back, you know, I, I, I feel a pain. I feel a pain in my back, so I take a lot of pain medication. Pain medication. Is this medication have a name? I think it's called Pecanec. A Pecanec? Pecanec, because it'll break your neck. I think that's what it's called. But really, really right, you know, I'm not 100% if I'm right or not, but you know what? It's like I always tell everybody, even if I'm wrong, Billy right is right. There's a lady here that says she likes NyQuil. She does, that does it for her, it's good. Yo, did you see that Amaretto? Amaretto just went on. I'm Frankie. I'm a getcha, Frankie. I'm a getcha. Damn. There's a lot of people. There's a lot of people highly upset with Mr. Frankie Cutler. I don't know why. I like Frankie. I like Amaretto. Yo, can you imagine all these people? Yo, can you imagine like making a show? with all these people like that's what i'm thinking like i'm right here and i'm like this hmm, hmm. like i'm thinking i'm gonna i want to get all these people and unite them together like the real crazy ones that's what i'm thinking i'm, I'm thinking about a sellout like uh this will be a smash yeah. hit bro that's why i want that remember, out. remember i want to be able remember Remember, I, I told you about that. That we talking about that half nude. Uh, yeah. That half nude. No, I, remember, I remember. Remember the half nude uh, pageant, the nude, the the first Florida freestyle nude pageant. Yo, guess yep. who I will invite? I'll invite Angelo, Angelo Martinez, as a as a as a judge. Angelo Martinez will be there. Freestyle Ricky will be there. Rocky Ramos will be there. Not sitting next to uh, Freestyle Ricky, but he'll be there. Amaretto. Frankie Cutlass, I'm uh, man. I'm I'm thinking this is a hit, bro. I'm thinking taking this shit all over the United States of America. Like, let's go on tour. Like, let's go see. Let's go find Miss Miss New Miss Miss Nude New York, Miss Nude Jersey, Miss Nude Florida, Miss Nude California. Like, and then we make Miss Flo Miss Freestyle USA nude, or half nude, or or. Bikini, micro bikini. So, so, uh, 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 right, Billy Wright. Billy Wright. <laughs> Yo, what is this freaking kid doing in my line, bro? Kid, get off the line. No, no, kid, don't mention that. Kid, 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 get off the line, kid. Get off the line. Go take your mom the phone. Go, go take. Kid, go. Kid, go take your mom the phone. Get off the phone, kid. Where's your mom? Is your mom? Little Billy. Little, Little Billy. Billy. Go give your mom the phone, bro. Is she still <laughs> Little Billy, is your mom still is your mom still in the Little room? Little Billy, do you want you want a bottle of milk? Little Billy take you in the bed. Get off the phone. No, don't tell my story. No, don't tell, tell your story. Okay. Tell the story. Tell the story. Go ahead, hurry story. up. Let him tell the story. Then I'm going to bed. Okay, go ahead, hurry up. It's my story. My mommy, she 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 has a coupon that it needs a lot of work done on it. And she goes to this guy named Robert, who's a mechanic, and she tells Mr. Robert that she doesn't have any money to pay. And she has an EBT card. It's wiped out. There's no money on it. So when he tried to tell me, I said, Mommy, you know, because this is we, we, we're stuck with no car. And I said, Mommy, how are you going to pay when? But I couldn't understand because she speaks Spanish. 
She said, what the heck are you paying? I'm just wondering if you're paying for you. She said, what the heck are you paying for? Yeah. Well, she means I'm gonna pay. means I'm gonna pay you through what's uh through Cash App. That's what she means. Is that what is that what I mean? I'm te voy a pagar con los pelos to the mechanic. She said that to the mechanic. I don't have any money right here. This is what she. I don't have any money here. Te voy a pagar con los pelos. That means I don't have any money. I'm gonna pay you through Cash App. That's what she meant. Because she had. Oh, no okay, money. I just wanted to know because I was trying to figure out because I didn't know how she was not getting to the car. And we, we, I have to get to school in the morning. So I'm going to go to sleep now, but I, 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 I love you so, but now please don't tell mommy I was coming here because I don't want to get in trouble. Kid, get, <laughs> kid, get off the phone, kid. Get, get off the phone. Get off the phone already. Right, go to sleep. Your mom is still. I don't know where it is, but it's like it's is your mom. Is your mom still? Is your mom still? Is your mom still Zumba? Is she still doing Zumba with Leroy and Tyrone in there in that room, Mister? When I went by the room, mommy had something in her mind, but mommy had something all the way in the back. In the back of her. It was. It was hitting the back of her neck. It, I think. I think it looked like when I get on a seesaw. Get the kid out of here. Kid, go. Get out of here, kid. Right now. Get out of here. Bye-bye, kid. Bye-bye. Go to sleep. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, kid. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay. Yo, uh, so, so, yeah, uh, Amaretto and, and Frankie here are, yeah. Going at it. They're going at it, right? Like a plan, clan, clean, clean, clan, clan, clan. Oh, my God. This is Billy Wright. I just came back to the bathroom, guys. I mean, what did I miss? Did I miss anything? No. <laughs> this, this two over here are, yeah. It's getting, this shit right here is getting dirty. Dirty between Amaretto and Frankie. Oh, my God. No. It's you, a Coca Nostra. Oh, Bernardo, my cousin said, uh, so Angel. From the sky, he just told me that to give you a message, and he said the great man said you would not be shut down. A great man said that. I like that. Angel, could we get Angel who? from the sky? Huh? Angel who? Could we get Angel from the sky over here in the line? Um, not today because he's at work, but. He said he'll 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 chime in on the next on the next show. Okay. Nice. Yo, this thing is getting really heavy over here. People, people, people. This is my page, people. I already got enough beef over here with the with Facebook and and, <laughs> and the cops from Port St. Lucie. Like, yo, bro, what's up? This is just an entertainment show. It's a showtime. Showtime. Look at this. Bro, you should take freestyle off the title because this has nothing to do with freestyle. No, it does. All these people, we are all okay. Give me a second. He gets mad. He hold gets on, mad because he don't know anything hold it, about hold it, freestyle. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. I got somebody on the phone over here. Hold on. Hold it. Hold it. Good evening. Uh, welcome to the Freestyle Crisis Center. Oh, may we help you today, sir? Or oh, ma'am? I, 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 puppy. I, 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 puppy. <laughs> oh, my God. Rocket Girl, so you are the original singer. Oh, she hung up. I was the original singer right there. <laughs> Who was that? 
L let me read a, a message from Jay Castillo over here. Um, yeah, he said that uh, uh, this is it. This is it. all of these people. The thing is that we are all here connected through freestyle. Freestyle is what brings us together. So even though it's kind of the content here is very strong, but at least we have a communication line. I know it's 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 gonna take Ooh. a moment. Shy. Was that Jay Castillo? Uh, shy, shy said shy, that. Shy, shy say that. Like take the the. Get shy on the phone. Nah, Shy don't want to pick up the phone. Shy is kind of shy. He don't want to pick up the phone. But nah. he's here. He's here. He's watching the whole thing. He's watching the whole Call thing. Shy. It's part of freestyle. It's part of freestyle. Call shy. Not... Nah, Shy because don't. Want... Nah. Once Shy gets on the phone, I'm gonna tell Shy, get the fuck out. Nah, nah. We love Shy. Shy is the man. Shy is the man. We love Shy, and I got a lot. I I would love to work with Shy. Shy is this people tomorrow. I will post the legal letter. Mm -hmm. See. Who wrote that? I'm Moreto, bro. I'm Moreto. Yeah. Stop getting the law involved. Yeah. I, I, and Daniela said, Daniela, Daniela says, Daniela says right here, I agree with, with Mr. Castillo. Yeah. This is all freestyle. This is just freestyle. The, the, this freestyle crisis center was not made up. Unfortunately, I have to tell you that I've seen 35 years of freestyle drama. So, Freestyle deserves to have a crisis center because a lot of drama over here. You know, at least we have a center now where, you know, where things don't get out of control. Like, for example, Freestyle Ricky, yesterday he made a video, right? And he says some crazy shit in this video. So the idea is that I'm trying to get Rocky Ramos, you know, in, and Rocky Ramos will come through because what Freestyle Ricky said was pretty crazy. You know what I'm saying? So the idea is for the story, so we can clear the story and shut it down immediately. I don't want Rocky Ramos' name to be stained. Why? Why will Rocky Ramos' name is going to be stained like that? Like, we're going to get Rocky in here, Rocky Ramos in here, and he's going to clear it out. And remember, that's what Freestyle Ricky said. Freestyle Ricky said that Rocky Ramos hit on him. About you know twelve years ago, like like one of some of that Ricky, that Ricky juice, Ricky good shit. You know what I'm saying? So we you know that you know that's what Ricky said. Just like Frankie, Frankie saying right here, like you know Frankie said right here, she did not sing the song. And Amaretto, when I let me tell, when I speak to Amaretto, Amaretto says. I did. I and she. She's not saying that she didn't. That she sang the whole song. She's just saying that she was part of it. She's saying the truth. That's she, was, she was part of it. Hold on. I got another call over here. Give me a second. Good evening. Welcome to the free freestyle crisis center. How may we help you? Hey, this is Zeke. I don't like you, Bernardo. Zeke. And we don't, and we don't like you. Goodbye. This is Zeke, and we don't like you. We don't and like, we don't like you either. We don't like you either. Seek. Be pretending that you're Seek. So you know, it's this. This is it. This is it. Like, like, dude. Like, like, this is just. Like, and we didn't have this before. Before, you know, you know, someone stained your your name, and then, you know, you carry that stain for years. And that's what I love about Facebook and all this life stuff. You know, that we are having an open discussion. You know, on you know, and clearing up a lot of stuff that just because we didn't have no Facebook back in the days, it was not cleared up. And now, for for example, Amaretta's having her date. She's having her day in court, and she's having her day in the freestyle community, too. And I'm liking this. I'm liking that, you know, Amaretto, for many years, her name was stained. She's not saying she sang the whole entire thing. All she's saying is that she was a part of this. She was one of the girls a part of this, and that her name is Amaretto J. Lopez. She understands that Amaretto is something else, but she's Amaretto J. Lopez. That's it. That's all she's saying. And, you know, that's it. You know, and then, but, but what happened is that, 
you know, because Amaretto, you know, what I'm seeing, because I wasn't there, but I, I you know, I hear that, that, you know, that Amaretto, she, she used to drink and stuff like that before, you know, and a lot, and she took a lot of heat for that. You know what I'm saying? A lot of shows, a lot of heat for that. And that's where, you know, all the, you know, all the punching of, of Amaretto comes through. You know what I'm saying? Because she's a very, like, she's an entertainer. She's a, she's full of energy. You know what I'm saying? Then again, if it was up to me, I'm a writer. If I if I have money, I invested all I invested in you. I would invest some freestyle money in you because you're an entertainer. You will if I had a like a like a freestyle company, like a like a record label and stuff like that. I invested in you just as I would invest in Rocky Ramo because it's the character, it's who you is. You know, not you know you you, you this is like this is like the the season where like people like Cardi B. That's it. I don't make it up. If it was up to me, I would be crooning. I would be a crooner. But unfortunately, we're done with the whole crooning part. We're done with 1940. This is the year 2019-220. And this is it. Frankie Cutlass. You know what I'm saying? Like that. Like, 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 like talk. In a world of followers, we need leaders. Talk. Be a leader. Like Frankie is. Like Amaretto. Like Rocky Ramos. Like Ricky Freestyle Ricky. You know what I'm saying? Michael, Billy. I'm here, I'm here. I'm here. Michael Sasson. Michael uh, Billy Wright. Say it loud and say it. Hey, clear. don't rock don't Rocky Ramos me. Don't you rock you Ramo me. Billy Wright. Uh I love I love Frankie Cutlass right now. He just posted Frankie Cutlass posted, come over here. Let me give you a hug. See that he's trying to make a man. You see what I'm saying, the man. The man. Look at. I like that. That's 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 very kind of him. Yeah, you sure he's trying to make a man? <laughs> Come on, people. Let's have fun over here. I don't know if that's trying to make a man, but okay. Hug. I'm gonna yeah. say hug. All right, people. Let's go. Let's let let's finish this up already, man. Been like two hours over here in this chat room. Yo, I'm so, yeah, I'm right up to Richie, you looking for an ass whooping. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see some 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 cornball on here try to say that that Bernardo showed me some K Star or whatever the hell his name is, a nobody on the, the this uh chat room trying to say that Bernardo needs a new co host. Get the who, fuck out of here. Who said that? Some phony baloney, some phony baloney named K Star. These people just got the nerve to talk about hey, somebody. Hey, hold on, I gotta call hey, her. Sir. I gotta call her. We got the wrong Henry's in the house. The wrong Henry. Okay? Respect and love. Senor Henry. Como anda la cosa? Hey, what's the matter for you? What's, what's up, up, my bro? friend? You're about, to, you're about to wind it up, huh? Yeah, bro, because you know, I am like two hours something over here live. Yeah, remember what I think when you, yeah, when well, you always go two, two to three hours, right? Something Since like the that. beginning. Try, the yeah. show always, it could go even longer. I bet you you could do a fucking marathon, bro. Yeah. If you, if you didn't have to work the next day, if people didn't have lives and things to do, you could probably all night go on and you still have your, 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 your little, your viewers, your viewers you know, whatever yes. you have. Yeah, because we're all just having fun over here and connecting and networking. Yeah, it's all about having fun. Hey, Billy, I got an idea, man. Uh, was that, uh, remember the song that you was going to do? Was that Billy that was writing the song? Yes, that was, that was Billy. Yeah, yeah we love so, that song. The ding, ding, yo, ding, ding, ding. Check this out. Instead of going doom, 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 doom you could do it in reverse. Okay. Do do doom 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 doom. No, no, I had it. I had it. Wait. Doom 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 do do doom. Oh, so you could go do do doom 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 do do doom 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 doom. You could do it in reverse. I like that baseline. It's a go, Billy. I like that. I like that shit. I like that. I like that. Just do it. That might work. That might work. We got to get two Frankie Carlos to put it put it in place. That's not the lick. That's not the bar. That's not the bar. That's not the bar. Look, it's do 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 doom 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 doom. <laughs> I'm, That's hot. That's I'm running out of material, so I'm trying yeah. to dig, dig yeah. shit up to be funny. Yeah. Well, I hope the the hip hop uh, community doesn't get a hold of what you just uh, uh, the chant that you just said right now. 
because they're yeah, gonna, just, they'll they'll jack that know. shit. That shit, they'll jack it in a moment. They'll take that shit. <laughs> so let's copy well, right heard it We don't want nobody to steal it now that we just put it live. Yeah, let's copy hey, right I, got right. a, I got a small handful no, of no. haters, bro. Hey, 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 Bernardo, I got I was I was reading some of the comics. Damn, I'm a nice guy. Even even they don't even like nice guys on your show, bro. I have people say no. say writing stupid comments that they don't even know me, bro. They're saying yeah. shit. Uh, I'm like, okay. Well, at least only a handful. Yeah. I can yeah, I can't imagine. No. But they're they're irrelevant. What? The wrong Henry, they're irrelevant. They're they they're, they're whack. Yeah. Huh? They're whack. They're, whack. Uh, they're, they're whack. irrelevant. Wow. Yeah, maybe it's because you're showing me some kind of love and they don't like that, you know, because you know, in order yeah. In order for you to show love up uh, for people to, right to say good night, you have to have some kind of creativity. I'm already okay. just say good Bye. night. I'm already just say good night. She said good okay. night. Good night, pricks. Okay. And, and um, let me let you get back to your crisis. All right, Papa. Good you. night. Thank you, my friend. All right. right. Hey, Bernardo, call that, call that dude uh, K Star. Who? Call that dude K Star. K Star? Yeah, K Star. Okay. Let's see if K Star. Answers the phone. Hold on. K star. Who wants to talk about your co host? I got, I got a phone to pick for him. How do you spell K star? It's K. Or tell him, the, yeah, K A K A Y star. K star. K star. This is crazy. Yo, um, do I got. He, he just told what he wants. Lo love you, baby. Love. Love you, Amaretto. Okay, K star. I don't want to, I don't want, yo, is this the guy that has like a Met, Mets? I don't want to call the wrong K, bro. It's too late to be calling the wrong K. Oh, no. I have the logo of the Mets. Mets, okay. Yeah. All right, let me do it. Yeah. Nah, no love for you. Oh, yeah, he's too, he's too, he's too big uh, to talk all that stuff on the keyboard, but he won't go on the phone. Like, what's up with that? Yeah. Yeah, the idea is that you, you come through. Come through, come through, come through, bro. Like, Jealousy. come through all the way, bro. Like, come through. Jealousy kills, Bernardo. Jealousy kills. When people see you doing something that they not doing, everybody's a critic. Everybody has something to say. At the end of the day, you know what? He wants to come on here. He wants to put in the chat room. You need to get some new co-hosts. Well, why don't you come on and be one of the co-hosts? If yeah. you think you got what it takes to sit here for hours and hours and try to push the limit and, and make it make something uh, uh, good and fun we and pure good. entertainment for we everybody. But today. these guys ain't about that. They want to bash and talk trash, but he, he can't even pick up the phone, Mr. K. Bob. We did good today. I saw a moment there with 80-something people in there. There was a moment there. There was 80-something of us here. So we did good today, and every day the numbers are growing little by little. And uh, I'm really liking this project because I know that in the long run, it's going to bring us together. It's going to bring us together. Yeah. Together, together. together for Shout out to Amaretto for coming on, man. Amaretto, Shout out to Amaretto, Amaretto for coming on. And, and Frankie a Cutler I and all, Angela. I wish all the girls from Freestyle would be like Amaretto. Amaretto's a monster, like a real G, bro. Like, that's why I'm liking her. <laughs> like, Amaretto don't care. Like, what's up, man? I'm telling you, people. Don't, bro, I'm telling you. Don't be scared. Yo, I'm don't be right surprised. She is not don't she be surprised. Don't be surprised that one of these days, Amaretto will be on mainstream uh, radio and like go all the way to the top and be on one of those uh, reality shows and just become a very successful person, make millions. Frankie just said good night, good night, Frankie, good night, night Amaretto, Angelo. You guys are great. Yeah. Yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's we're done for the for the for the night. So we come back another time, right? Maybe uh Wednesday or something like that. So thank you everyone for being there, and uh we'll see you soon at the Freestyle Crisis Center, okay? So keep the uh, crisis coming. Ooh. 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 Ooh.